that project been out a, a minute. I really like that beat. So it's really fantastic. Nice. I appreciate it. I appreciate really it. Nice. Mm. I sampled. It. I feel like I've heard it because I think I I like wanted to like fucking download it, but I couldn't remember the name. So now I'm gonna remember it today. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. I need your streams. Yeah, we're gonna. <laughs> <laughs> we need your streams. You. We need it. The name of the song okay. is in the bio. So let's toast to this episode. Toast. Do I get both cooked? No, nigga. This nigga smell both. <laughs> right. Hey, I didn't make sure both now. Mm-hmm. Oh, let's do it. Huh. Oh. Hmm. 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 What did it say? Spicy aftertaste? That motherfucker real spicy. Yeah, they put some this cayenne in that motherfucker. It, it tastes like chicken a little bit. Pine. What? Huh? It say basil on there. I, I know <laughs> basil be on Tomato chicken. and basil. This nigga. Nah. Pasta. No. <laughs> this nigga chewing. I can like show my nails now. Oh. Oh, okay. That's. Oh um, my god. Okay. All right. I got a. I got a couple of things. Wait. Okay. Do your thing. <laughs> Hi, everyone. Welcome to episode twenty-three of the Henny Haters Club. What show is this? What episode is this? Was I right? Is that correct? Cool. I'm Fred. Right. This is Darius. This is Brittany. What's happening, Why are you nigga? So aggressive. Yeah, that was. That was aggressive. aggressive. I'm sorry. Let me. <clears throat> Hi guys. My body's still processing. <laughs> Welcome to shot. episode 23 of the Henny Haters Club. My name is Fred. To my left is Brittany. To my right, we have Darius. And today's special guest is an old friend of this mine. This nigga sound like a game show host. <laughs> it's welcoming though. I feel calm next to him. <laughs> <laughs> it, feels, it sounds great, bro. Tonight we have your guest. <laughs> oh, this is the portion. Yes, who are you? Oh, okay. My um, guy. I'm Dizzy Chopping, man, producer from the south side of Atlanta. Um, so sorry. Yeah, man, that's me, man. I make beats. Uh, if you ever hear a tag, it says Dizzy, what up? That's me. Yeah, I mean, I'm me, bro. I, just, <laughs> <laughs> I make beats, people. Bro. I make beats, man. That's what I do. I try rapping, but I'm not. I'm not good. <laughs> not lyrically right. inclined, I'm like not, the most I'm of us. It's good. okay. It's all right. So, I mean, most people can't own the shit they not good at. Wait, can I say shit? Are y'all syndicated or some shit? Nigga, we drink liquor, nigga. Okay, well, yeah, people... Well, well no, we, we can't get syndicated and drink liquor. I don't know. Wait, I just wonder. Because I was really, if anyone wants to syndicate us. Uh, but, yeah. Oops. Um, <laughs> I'd like to start off this show with uh, two announcements, okay? Okay. First... I have allergies, so if you see me sneeze, I don't have corona. All right. I think it's only if you cough. Oh, cough. Sneezing's okay. Like if you cough, I looked it up. They got like twenty symptoms on that motherfucker. Yeah, that's a lot. Sounds about right. Niggas don't know what's going on. They add one like every day. Yeah, it's a new one every day. (laughs) But I don't think sneezing is the problem. Like, if you sneeze, you're good. But you're, if you're out and you cough, oh, okay. motherfucker sneeze. Oh, that nigga just got the flu. See, but I was in <laughs> IKEA. I was in IKEA today, and I, you know, I let one off a little sneeze, and everybody turned around like. Stay I mean, we are gonna, approaching flu season. Stay like, away from that nigga. Right. <laughs> Right. The second half of the year. <laughs> so you're right. I guess you gotta be careful. Yeah, you don't so got the you, flu or corona. You gotta throw that out there these yeah, days. Man. And secondly, they have their own coasters. These are five. <laughs> All right. If you've been on this show and you haven't acknowledged how five these are, <laughs> you should be ashamed of yourself. All right. Their logo, bam, front to the back, the name. All right. <laughs> Both sides. These are cool. All right. Double sided. Thank like you, corn. Fred. Thank you, Fred, for inviting me. You're welcome, I man. I feel important now. Of course. <laughs> All right. And what do we have the pleasure of drinking today? Can you read man, we drinking some motherfucking goddamn, goddamn white beater basil on. Basil <laughs> It got a belt Championship on. belt. <laughs> hard. Got a little Ferragamo thing it's going on. It's made with basil, it's people. Ooh, it's, it's artfully aged. Artfully. Oh, what does that even mean? Artfully I aged. I don't know, but that's, that's fancy. That's how do you real artfully, descriptive. How do you artfully pass by time? That's some... That's some shit. That's some philosopher. That shit got a Ferragamo belt on. This bitch. And is the funny hard. thing about me buying this, I was at the liquor store. I was on the liquor store on the south side, mm-hmm. and I'm looking at the shit. And this white dude walks up, and he's just like, he was like, "Look like you're having some trouble there, man." I'm just like, "Uh, I mean, just trying to pick up something." Cause Cause you was black. Some white dude bothering you, you at the liquor store. Cause they always just want to be like the third time this happened. Huh? Cause you was black. They ain't no, steered you wrong yet, though. Was your dread hanging? Does, why but does wait, being wait, wait, black wait. and confused equal people asking you questions? You can go anywhere oh, no. right now, be black and look confused. Somebody's going to ask you some shit. You're right. Yeah. You're right. 
Hey Turn man, are around. you okay, Do man? Do you need some help? Do you need dead me to ass. kneel right quick? <laughs> <laughs> no, dead ass went to Home Depot. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, dumb broke it. You good? No, I broke no, it. No, it's all good. No, you said it's all good. Don't say that. I'm good. Nick, just a little loose. Okay. That's all good. You are? We back yeah. right. We in We are? That might get around. Let's do it. Cool. You fucking right. went to Home Depot when I tell you, and we're waiting on my mom at the returns. When I tell you, me and my dad are just minding our business, talking, yeah. literally 10 fucking associates were like, you need yeah. any help? You okay? Like, right after you. Man, I was like, this is great customer service. Just happy to be back at work. That's I was all. like, this is great customer service. Home Depot? But nigga, they no. never left. Oh, yeah, yeah, they true, did never leave. Home yeah, Depot yeah, is they essential. essential. They was on our ass. Okay. I'm like, damn. You want to know why they do that? They want black people in and out of their establishment <laughs> as quickly as, as possible. <laughs> but this white dude, he ain't work, he ain't working the liquor store. He just pulled up on me and he was just like, he was like, you tell me about any whiskey you want to know about. I'll tell you about it. I drank damn near everything that's so on this rack. Re- he didn't even work there. What? No, 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 no. No, he was some weird, oddly shaped motherfucker. Did that so, nigga emerge from the shadows? Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Right. So I was like, all right, what about this one? He's like, never had it. Said, cool, I'm buying it. Like he just said he had all of them. Uh, exactly. Exactly. I'm like, See, you fucking phony. Right That's why I'm about to get this lie. bottle. Yeah. They all I was like, you don't know nothing about it? But this bottle makes me better than you. <laughs> right. I'm going to buy it. I hate to. Hey, no, I don't. I yep. shouldn't have said that. I'm, I don't. I'm not racist. Black don't, people can't I be racist. I love everybody. Don't be racist. You know what? I had an argument <laughs> with my girl about that. All right. I don't know. It's hard to argue with your girl. <laughs> she looking like, yeah, sure did. <laughs> How'd that go? How'd that but go? I, I'm, I'm not even going to go into it because I lost the argument. I was wrong, <laughs> and I don't like being <laughs> wrong, so I'm not even going to bring it up. Just know that I'm not racist, even though I can't be racist, but I think that was racist. Well, that's, toast. <laughs> that's toast to not so, being racist. All right. Another toast. Let's do it. Whoa. You can't be racist. Okay. Then I toast. I learned something new. So y'all don't get a hint of chicken fingers when y'all eat? <laughs> drink this? Not a hint? No. A no. You just had chicken though. Uh, Fred. <laughs> <laughs> that makes a lot of fucking sense. That's what it was. <laughs> That's what it was. You still got some left in that shot glass, my dude. Yeah. And yeah, that was the man. first shot, so he was bullshitting off the first one. <laughs> Mm. Mm. Catching him, catching him in his lies, man. Wouldn't even pay attention. Yeah, you gotta catch him. Man. Anyway, man, how y'all been? How y'all week? How y'all week going? The week, the week is going, bro. It's okay. And the Sounds job I work it. at, so it's like I work three days a week okay. on That's the awesome. weekends. Oh, okay. But no, it's not awesome because I work like week? twelve, twelve hour shifts. Like Dead. you're there fucking all day. Dead. Like your weekend is done. Yeah. No, this is your weekend. Like when this that is, nigga Aubrey said working on the weekends like usual. <laughs> so done. You felt that? <laughs> that's my bar. That shit hit. That's my bar. This nigga heard that I was like, that's me. That's me. How I did he know? Uh, this nigga spit. <laughs> <laughs> Cause usually rappers shit on the shit that you have, right? Right. And for him <laughs> working on the weekends is usually. Yeah, like, I was like, one for me. Me too. Yes. <laughs> I felt him on that. Yes. But Terrible. yeah, during the week, the days just go by, bro. There's nothing open. You gotta have a mask everywhere. Yeah, sounds about right. You know what I'm saying? So your days, but before you know it, you back at work all day. Yeah. I mean, I've been off. I've been off the past four months. So. For, oh, what you do? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> yeah, no. I mean, it. I had a job, then I got a new job, uh-huh. but then fucking Corona hit, so yeah, I don't start Rona. until Monday. Monday, Monday, I start. Not Monday. Monday, yeah. Monday. Monday. Monday, I start. It's Corona I, and I Monday. Been working Monday. For Monday is now infected by the Corona. What you collecting at unemployment? Monday. Actually, <laughs> you would think that them niggas took forever to pay me. Uh, I got that back pay though. No, so, you yeah. got to get the back pay. They still pay right, me. You got to protect the back but pay. I'm working. Oh, yeah. I think I only get like one more weekend before I start. Sorry, your company is trash. Anymore. <laughs> trash. <laughs> That's crazy. That's cr- yeah, niggas oh who've been working are. I I really didn't understand why niggas were so mad. I am tired. Then that check hit. I was like, so I know tired. why niggas that are working are mad because niggas. I am so At least they gave tired. us a special name, essential. Right, made me yeah, feel yeah, good a like little bit. I, I guess. Like, man, hey, I'm let me get my essential ass up. Yeah, let me get I'm my I'm important. Essential. I'm important, bro. I'll be not important. You know what I'm saying? Y'all niggas need me f- to keep the internet on. This so nigga putting, y'all. putting his uniform uniform shirt on. Yeah. Y'all need me <laughs> to goddamn yeah. 
Except or happily, packages of clothing. Happily be not important. <laughs> Why are people still ordering clothes? I ordered some clothes. I, I, I'm, <laughs> I, I'm happy I'm essential, but it's like, why am I essential? Like, I work in a clothing factory, right? And it's like, I get why you're ordering clothes now. It's like, it's kind of died down. It's like, mm-hmm. a, yeah. I don't it did die down. Uh, it's just yeah. shit opening up. Yeah, Niggas right. pretending like it but died. But it's like, <laughs> <laughs> at the beginning, we didn't know what the fuck was going on. Yeah, we really Like, yeah. that was the time to order water. Food and shelter in like niggas was ordering socks. Hey, these pants Sock. cute. Turtlenecks like I don't know. If I can wear this to the kitchen. Like, <laughs> shit's crazy, bro. But I'm glad I'm essential. Thank y'all. Keep ordering shit. <laughs> like I appreciate it, bro. Uh, I, I'm glad I wasn't essential. Right, I will be non-important. Even though I did go through like some serious weird health things while being at home. I'm not gonna get into because it it's kind of embarrassing. But just know that my life you, was a you, little. You was you was constipated. No, because <laughs> no I'm telling you, people been at home eating that bull, and <laughs> constipated. Niggas bro. forgot they couldn't cook. Right. <laughs> ah, ah. Oh shit, we can't go to Wendy's. <laughs> Fuck, I guess I do. Um, uh, I ain't turn the thing on. Speaking, of, well, when you say cooking, like I don't mean to offend you because you're the only female on the on the show. But it's like, why females feel like? The man's supposed to cook. I mean, not cook, but provide everything. And you can't do half the stuff female's supposed to do. Like, if I'm going to pay all your bills. You're going to get in trouble for that statement. Yeah, I know. But no, 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 no. This nigga said supposed to do. Hey, look, my girl not like that. But listen, it's like, you need to pay my bills. You ain't doing nothing for me. You need to pay this, pay that, pay that. You can only cook Rotel dip. Hotel dip and shrimp alfredo. That's what I gotta eat every day. <laughs> but I'm paying your bills, car insurance, all that. Well, first lot, of man. all, well, first of all, you should make some rotel soon. Oh, Second of all, yeah, I'm not the good. type of bitch either. I, yeah. I firmly believe in that Virgil, Virgil. You know what I'm saying? That's what I believe in. What's what's that? Fifty fifty. Fifty oh, fifty. Okay. Poor Virgil. Okay. <laughs> I am from. I'm mad firm nobody Virgil. got that. <laughs> oh, you know I about definitely the dude got who's, it. Who, who's paid fifty dollars? Yeah. yeah, he's trifling. <laughs> I, <laughs> <definitely>. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. If you, yeah, I try to keep it Virgil, Virgil. <laughs> if you're yeah, if you're I watching this Virgil, <laughs> first he, of all, I, I get where you're coming. From. I <laughs> get where not. the pain is stemming from. Most people want to judge you, but if I went every day in my life was name, I was named Virgil. Done. That's tough. No. Like it's cool now. Nigga <laughs> shitting famous. on his name. Yeah. It's cool now because you're famous. Like all black fly, dude, black Virgil. dude named Virgil. Yeah, you gonna have a little. You, elementary you better, school, you middle school. Think be about artsy. it. How could Virgil? We trust that was tough. Is Virgil? Yeah. A nigga that named was Virgil. tough. You can't even get a nick. Try to make a nickname out of Virgil. Virgil. Right Verver. 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 Virgil. Virgil. Picture walking down the hot hallway in middle school and you hear Verver. Ver. Big wait, Jelly. Wait, 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 wait. Pause, 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 pause. Isn't that Static Shock real name, Virgil? Uh, Ooh. 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 Wait, wait. Damn it, Greg. We're not different. trying to make him but, cool. But, static, but yeah, but Static yeah, Shock was down. already cool. Like, he you had took dreads. took the wrong way. We're not trying right. to make him cool, Fred. He had a theme song. This nigga was shitting on his whole Yo, existence nigga nigga had because of his name. My nigga had sewer leaves. But we well, can't lit up. At the same time, we we never saw Static Shock We're talking about fuck the real Virgil. Static Shock was not Mr. Bitches. Women. I don't. He had a white Not even women. I just don't fuck with. That was his only friend. A white I don't fuck with individuals doing that in general. That's true. <laughs> so, and look at Virgil. Shut up, nigga. So, all of his friends are white. What made you- wait, wait. What did you just say? <laughs> huh? Okay, anyway, we just going. What made you, made you choose the 50 50 route? I mean, I, I don't mean, I just feel like I was raised like that. I mean, I live, not saying that people. I live in like a two parent household. They just, I just was brought up like that, you know? Uh, like it's a union. Partnership, uh, like the fuck. So they split the bills. They split. Yeah, everything. like my mom takes care of some stuff. My dad takes care of some stuff. Like yeah, it should just the, be like it the conversation be. that we had the last pod was it the last pod or two pods ago when I two pods ago when I asked, um, when should finances be involved in a relationship? Yeah, think, yeah. Mm-hmm. And I had that conversation with my mom yesterday, and my mom and my sister. And my mom was like, that shouldn't be a thing until like. You're about to get engaged. When you're thinking about being engaged, that's when it's like, all right, let's talk money. Because, <laughs> well, yeah. because when you talk money, you talk important <laughs> things like debt. Yeah, that's because. What I mean. But you know what's crazy? 
A lot of couples don't. They don't do know that, that shit. Because right. Cause I a lot of couples would stop at that point. Bitches get married yeah. and don't even know their niggas in debt. Or vice versa. Niggas would be I'm like, like whoop, I'm broke. <laughs> what about you? See, hey, listen. <laughs> <laughs> and hey, look. With my girl, I told her off the motherfucking press. Hey, look, I got fucked up credit. All right, let's just start there. Did I not that start off good. Date. I told her, look, hey, you looking for a nigga with some credit? <laughs> not, not him. Me. Better look All for right. a Tommy. Better, hey, better look for something. But it ain't me. It's no, me. never mind. Hold on, because I know some niggas <laughs> named Tommy that got some terrible credit. I'm trying to be like, for real. I take that back. I oh, you mean like a white person? Okay. Oh, you're saying a white name. Okay. But at the same time, I don't mean that because you can find a brother with some good credit. You can. Yeah, you can, bro. Just but credit ain't everything. This brother. You can. All right. Yeah, no, no. Minus, minus semi. I mean, plus it's Fuck. just, I mean, it's just general common decency, like human decency, being fair. I mean, like, yeah. just fair essentials. <laughs> being fair. Mm. One yeah. person shouldn't be doing everything right. while you're just. But I feel it. like. I don't think it should start when you when you marry. My my pops always told me if you like if you're in charge of a household, whether that be a apartment or whatever, and it's just your girl. But if your girl got them cooking, cleaning, washing your dirty drawers, you need to help her with her bills. Mm-hmm. You feel me? Well, that makes sense. I mean, well, she's you know doing. Like I said, something's being done. But right. some some of them ain't <laughs> doing all that. But if all no. you making is Rotel dip, <laughs> I'm not paying your half of the Mm-mm. rent for Rotel dip. I swear, there's a lot of women out here that only good for taking selfies, bro. So next pot Rotel though, or excuse me. Okay. Do y'all, how y'all make y'all rotel? Yeah. I like the little shrimp. I was just asking. Thing, no, like I said, that was the only <laughs> thing that little bitty bitch did correct. That shrimp and that damn dip at your barbecue. Ooh. What did he say? It was so good. Little that's all she good for. <laughs> hey, let's just pause. Hey. Yeah, there yeah, because that <laughs> just, I was yeah. like, this bitch did something right. Huh? Ooh, this is good. I like to say, <laughs> shout out to Walmart for the five dollar bag of shrimp. Y'all are I'm... looking out. All right, and I know y'all on tr- y'all. What fuck brand with y'all. are you y'all buying? Y'all don't know about the five dollar shrimp bag. I, I know about the five dollar shrimp bag. They right next to the top. I feel like I feel like I I don't. I never seen them for five. It's a blue bag. It's a blue bag. I, I feel like really I five? get that from Kroger. They five dollars, five ninety nine. I thought they were like a little bit more. Maybe not. Okay, man, I'm telling you. I thought I got that shout from Kroger. Shout out to Walmart. Fuck y'all, but shout out, shout out to y'all. Y'all fuck with Trump, <laughs> yeah. but it's all good. You know what I'm saying? Keep them shrimp. Yeah, but good. back to this finances oh, yeah, and relationship so shit. Yeah. Um, the finances and relationship shit. Uh, in the conversation I was having with my mom, mm-hmm. I realized that this is this is a speculation because. I'm not in a relationship, but you know, just me seeing the scope of things, mm. seeing what's happening, being on the internet and shit, the Twitter, Twitterverse. Not the Twitter. You know what I'm saying? You you realize that a Twitter. lot of a lot of these race race racially <laughs> relationships are um instant gratification. Mm. That's what it is. It's it. a lot of people aren't in it for the long game, which is weird. It's mm. weird. Cause why the fuck am I in a relationship with you? Yeah. If I'm not here to be with you for an extended period of time, and I be right. trying to, I be trying to tell women that that I meet, they be like, "You trying to be my nigga?" And I'm like, "Whoa, slow down." <laughs> I don't you know don't you. know me. You don't even know. But it's I could hard. be an abusive ass nigga, and you just. But, but, but it's, they, it's hard. You trying it's to be my hard, nigga? It's like you look good everything in our society so. is temporary now, though. Yeah, and it's hard to program your brain for certain things and switch it. For the next, like mm-hmm. we'll get an iPhone X, and next thing, two weeks later, it's an iPhone X two. It's like fuck, and I'm gonna get that. Bitch. I'm going on to the next. <laughs> one. I'm, say I'm gonna get I'm that shit. It. You know what I'm saying? It's like, oh, I just bought a PS4, the PS5 coming out. Let me goddamn get and that. I'm gonna get that. It's bitch. like Slow everything is temporary now. And is it's there a like, price for that? People no, don't know yet. how no, to. No. People don't know how to separate. You know shit, and they just bring it into their relationship. Like, I mean, oh, that's true. And I just right. think, like I said, this nigga got a nice car. Yeah, I would say things are different. Yeah, it is get late. Like, women and, women they, turn they, down dudes who drive certain cars. Like, right, what the fuck? Right. Do biddies really still do that? Yes. Right. They care about your car. Yes. You're right. That's big. Oh, you it's drive a Jetta? Uh-uh. That nigga, right. he picked you up, right? That is what you drive? Right. Like, what? Slow down. Some, some females her, would rather you get out a good-looking Uber than drive something Jetta. raggedy. I drive some right. I like those. I like those women, but Dave's I have yet to find one. Push. I'm so <laughs> I was trying to say bitches because I was like, with you, I was like, this nigga looks good aesthetically. So I feel like bitches just be like, 
He a big nigga with a beard. But they like, they've taken the purpose of dating out of dating. Right. Yeah, I said everything's for show. Looks. But granted, and a free meal. I feel like I feel like a lot well, of women. I'm gonna be get looking, my free meal. I feel like a lot of women be looking at what nigga would aesthetically go with my Instagram. Account. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like right. that, that damn near. Right. Like what? Because I'm saying like. Who yo, can I post on my like story yo look and good. not yeah. be judged? Like in front of her friends. Yeah. Like when right. they see you. What nigga match my vibe for my right. IG? When they see you, right. they're going to be like. Oh, you I got like, a mysterious IG, so I need a mysterious nigga. nigga. Don't even like the nigga. Don't even <laughs> like the nigga. <laughs> Ugly as fuck. But y'all look good together. What I say? So I'm going to go for it. Right. First right. date. Y'all don't really give a fuck we about this. We a cute name. couple. Right. so. And I think the problem is we merge dating and talking. Oh yeah, like definitely. I feel like yes. it's a yeah, difference. It's a like huge there's a difference. Difference. I feel like it's frowned upon to date multiple niggas. I'm like no, if you no, date multiple baby. niggas, go ahead, baby. No, baby. You feel me? You can talk to as many people as you want to. Like you're dating, date. You know what I'm saying? Toast. I think that's what, just what happens. Let's is, all toast to that. Like you, you've never been in it's a toast. situation where it's like it's toast. Yeah. For 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 this person right here, we're Who not gonna name her. Shall remain nameless for now. Yeah. It's like you ever been talking to well dating somebody. Then they go through your phone or something, see you text another bitches. It's like, and they get upset. Get upset. I'm dating. I'm getting to know you. <laughs> That's and what this people. is for. See which one I, I want. Okay, like I pointed out before. Survival of the fittest. I just think right. the miscommunication. Where's your competitive side? Comes, <laughs> I think the miscommunication comes with some people is like I said when there's a lack of transparency. Mm. Like if you're not upfront with that shit, yeah, you know, be upfront. Be like, yeah, we dating other people. That's what we on cool. Don't mm-hmm. be like. You gotta say that. Period. But what if I never insinuate I'm only talking to you? Nigga, I don't care. No, you're no, just no, gonna no, automatically no, assume no, no, the no, nigga's no, only no, talking no. to you. The wh- like me or like women? Uh-uh, Cause you're not women. So speak well, for I'm women. A, I'm a woman. So <laughs> I mean. Um, like I feel like a How vast you feel? majority off camera person. <laughs> I feel like a vast majority of them. How would you feel? <laughs> If somebody didn't insinuate that they were talking only to me, yeah. I feel like they're talking to other people. Like, I'll instantly feel that way. If you didn't tell me that you were only talking to me, I'm gonna feel like you're talking to other people. Women, exactly. the vast majority of them, do not think like that, or they oh, think, or they think they think like that, and then some shit hits the fan. <laughs> but what? And then they're they like, oh my they, god. Because yeah, I'm about to say, like, I've I've noticed women, women let you date whoever till they make you rotel dip. Then it's over with. <laughs> After you I made this nigga rotel, rotel dip, you're their nigga. All right? Just, I made this nigga Stop rotel. Oh my God. You're done. All right? She make you that rotel dip. Do you make the dip. rotel? If you dip one nacho in that fucking rotel <laughs> dip, you, you, you are a nigga. All right? <laughs> Do you make good rotel? She no. Make, no she make good girl, rotel. My girl <laughs> makes excellent rotel. Okay. rotel. She Somebody does. made this but nigga she, rotel and scarred this nigga for life. She used this seasoning called Sasson. She put that shit on there. Now y'all got to come back. She got to bring the dip. I got I to gotta taste the dip now. God damn it. This nigga making this shit sound Hey, it's phenomenal. good. But I'm no, telling you, you get hooked. What I've noticed is there's a lot of women who like advanced relationships. When I say relationships, I mean like whatever. Any relationship with niggas who don't really give a fuck about them. And they be like advancing that shit to the, the, the 10th degree, right. nigga. Like... I okay, think. I kind of like this person. Mm-hmm. That's my nigga now. Like, whoa. Right. But what what do you like him for? It be yeah, it like, be superficial. You shit. don't really know the way me. He look, his beard, his you car. Just, just like, know I have a big dick and it's great. That's all you know. That's all you know. You don't, you don't know, know about, about my mental health issues. Neither do you care. Right. Ooh. Till you expose them, then she like, oh, this not is nor too do much. you care. Damn, bro. Damn, not damn, not damn she don't care, bro. <laughs> That's crazy. You think she don't care? Women don't be caring about niggas' mental health. Damn, health. bro. She be like, is that dick Some okay? Some of them don't. <laughs> <laughs> is the dick good? Is you the dick right? okay? You might be fucked up. All right, up, then, nigga. Shut the, the fuck up. Right, right. Man up. For Man, real, bro. It's I crazy. just feel like in general, and like I said, I like to try to be the equality person over here. I feel like niggas and bitches. Bitches do it more. But I just feel like in the beginning, you just need to make shit really clear. And I feel like some bitches and niggas, I just feel like they get into their feelings too much. Mm-hmm. And if you are in your feelings, I understand you're supposed to express yourself. Yeah. But I do believe in some situations, it's like, tighten that shit up. Like, don't share that shit. Like, you over here freaking out over this nigga. Like, tighten yeah. it up a bit. Like, because you look a little 
I can understand. Thirsty. You look a little. You look a little like hurt. You can't like. Don't go out like no. I can fucking, understand. I can understand her point. Like, don't no, take that out. I, I, I wouldn't say that. I would say if you emotional. Be you. If you know you get attached quick, be you. That's true. That's why I said from the beginning. Be, be emotional with emotional niggas. Like, y'all be trying to be <laughs> emotional with the wrong, like a hood nigga. A hood Ooh. nigga don't give a fuck. Yeah. That's very like, true. Like, if you know what type of person you are, be with that type That's of person. That's very true. He's not if wrong. If you know you toxic, don't be going for the church girl. Go for somebody <laughs> who gonna match your toxic. Right. That's true. You feel me? Don't people go too don't, crazy. And, and that comes from people not knowing who they are, bro. You gotta get He got real deep. And you know who you are through dating multiple people. Yeah. All right. So... Everybody, not just ladies and gentlemen. It's Gotta, facts. You don't know what she has you can handle until dip, you bit nigga. Y'all can date this nigga in this role. And honestly, that's a big that's a big reason why I don't believe in high school sweethearts. Because it's just like you don't even know. Like, how you gonna say your soulmate is somebody you went to the same high school with? I don't think I can't. Necessarily the world agree with is that. such a vast place. It you need to tell you. me that right. your soulmate is You're the right. person you just so happen to go to high school. I with. think it's weird. You think God wanted your life to be that? It just easy? happens. It happens. I mean, like it that. happens. But how do you like know that? he did it? <laughs> some some people, some it's people, eight steps billion just people in the world. Like some that. have been very mm, successful. Sometimes. High school sweethearts. Uh, yeah, I know one right now. They're a very successful. Couple. Eight billion people in the world. I'm not saying you can't do it. I'm not saying it's impossible to love somebody you went to high school with. Just think it's very strange. I think it's very strange. It's just that, rare, that, yeah. bro. Like it's maybe rare. maybe if you go venture out and come back. Cool. And y'all but, still together. But if y'all yeah. were always in high school and just always been together since high school, I think that's strange. Yeah. Because nice. I couldn't do it. Because I personally feel like you putting yourself on a personality crutch. Like you grow grown up always trying to satisfy this one person. And it's just like that's all you know is satisfying this person. What if something happens to them or if they decide they don't want to be with you no more after all this time? You now don't handle it. Now you're this person that was always catered to satisfy them. Then what the fuck do you do? Right. That's hard. I granted, you don't even. That's know why. You why you in a relationship? Granted, sometimes you just gotta go out there and do what you do, just to see if you still got you it. Sometimes you gotta go out there and do what you do. Wow. Let's see what the fuck happens. Don't don't do that. No, I, don't, just, I wouldn't advise don't that. Do people. that. Don't do that. All right. Don't do that. Don't do that. Okay. I just. Wait, I, I didn't think, hear what he said. What did he say? Advise do. It's <laughs> very pretty. He's tripping. I'm just what did he say? I said sometimes you just gotta go out and see if you still got it. You know what I'm saying? You ain't don't got. Do you ain't still got, got it. These, you ain't gotta get these bitches. Nigga cheat. You ain't gotta. No, no, no. See, see, see. She took it somewhere. I was not no, trying to take we it. We don't but. cheat. We don't cheat. We don't cheat. Are you still with the bitch? No. Especially. Are you still with the bitch? I'm asking Fred in that scenario. You still with the bitch? Are y'all? Are y'all not. separated? Of course not. Yes. We're together. What? 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 I'm, I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> what is he talking about? I'm Mar- I'm like Mark Cuban. I'm out. <laughs> I'm no. out. But what's wrong? What's what's wrong with going cheating. out? What, what's wrong with going okay, out? I got both. I listen, got both. Listen, doing listen, that? listen, listen, listen. What's wrong? About. What's wrong with me going out and just being like? Just Are you both a, doing like that? a light flirt? Not, you, what I, is I, a light flirt, Fred? It's like, oh shit, you look good. Do that and then move on with my day. That's not like really venturing I think out. I, listen, listen. I'm not. Like, whoa, 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 whoa! I'm not saying venture out. That's where you got me fucked up. I said you're just saying light flirting. I just said, go out and see if you got it. You know what I'm saying? If, like, if a girl turn around two times, you be like, I still got it. Okay. You, know you want some Aisha Curry Listen, shit. listen, okay. listen. <laughs> if you was at the mall or something with your girl, and she just so happened to be standing, you know, somewhere over there waiting while you waiting on her, and you overhear her say to a nigga, are you cute? And then she walked back to you. Mega problem. Hey, boyfriend, you're like you're not mad at all. Yeah, you're gonna have a problem. Come on, that's Ray. not for her. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> that's why, I, and that's why that's I asked. Me. That's why I asked. Is Look, she doing it too? Me. But if she doing it too, one thing. Because if they're not, if y'all not both still, doing it. Because here's the difference. Mm-hmm. Niggas always want to fuck my woman. That's point blank. Period. Okay. Because that's niggas. That's okay. crazy. Right. How do y'all feel about that? I hate it. Niggas want but to it's fuck facts. You <laughs> like you when you go somewhere with your girl and you can just I mean, feel bro, niggas. Bro, listen, listen, listen. Staring. When you first seen your girl, you wanted to fuck her too. So listen. That's what I'm saying. Yes. Like, do y'all not feel kind of like, it's yeah, tough. That's my bitch. I, I, like, I got I, a bad bitch. I can honestly say it's harder being with an attractive woman than being with a non attractive woman. Yeah. Well, duh. It's tough. It's pressure, but man. It's, like, it's pressure. I mean, you person, know your girl. Yeah. I feel like you get immune to it afterwards. You know your girl got a fat ass. You know when you walk past That's what I'm saying. Y'all don't feel kind of. Y'all don't feel like, kind of like I dealt with that. Y'all don't yes, kind of feel did. like I have the bad like bitch type just, thing. No. Like that's not how y'all feel. Like yeah, I mean I definitely be having that mentality. Like, oh, I got yeah, like, yeah, I got her though. Yeah, and at the same time I'd be like I want one of these niggas oh. to try and pull her. I want Facts. one of these niggas. I will beat. Right. I will steal ass. off on this nigga. 
Oh, I can't wait. Sometimes it's say good. sometimes I say think that's something. why I say talk something. to fine women so say I can something. beat a nigga ass. Say but something. the good, the, the beauty, <laughs> the beauty of talking to a fine woman is she get niggas coming at her all the time, so she just knows how to easily deny niggas. No, no, no. no. I feel well. The right beautiful woman. No, no, no. The right beautiful woman. No. Some women don't know what the fuck. No, no matter how long they've been attracted, they still don't they know love the it. Fuck. It's, it's called attention. Like, it's true. called and attention. Those, <laughs> and those be the ones who really a, know how to cook Rotel and Alfredo. <laughs> was that Boy, another them. compliment? Like for real, bro. Oh, you're in the Again? You gotta, I'm ugly, boy. Stop. Right. You know, I, I'm I'm fucking hate when girls I be think, like, I think I'm it's ugly. important. Like, why y'all be like, I'm ugly? Maybe you think Why do me? women always have insecurities about shit that niggas really be liking? What? My butt is so big. Know- okay, I don't think my no. boobs are yes, so I was, big. I was teased. I, I was teased I in high school for my curves. I don't think no 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 no. Me. My lips were so juicy. Freeze that shit. And okay. Succulent. I don't think any black bitch has ever been out here and be like, oh, my ass is too fat. You they used to pick on me because I had light brown eyes. Black bitches eyes. be same, black, nah, so it be some conservative big booty bitches who don't want yes. to have it. Yes. They be and hating like that blessed shit. Blessed you, yes. God blessed you. Them ungrateful bitches. I be hating when niggas always want to talk uh, about my ass. Oh, they want. They don't even want to get that. Niggas know don't me. even know me. I mean, actually, 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 <laughs> I'm gonna know. bow this conversation. Because <laughs> you know some. You thinking about it? I mean, I do it. I hate my boobs. They're fucking huge and annoying. Yeah, yeah, there it is. All right. Oop, there it is. And you know how many small-breasted me. women is out there? And like, I know. I'm. I know. Right. You know how many but they don't want bite these, bitches. They don't want these problems at all. Okay. It's like everybody always think it's green on the side. But I rather no, no, be no, no, blessed no, 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 with no. what you got. Okay. Exactly. Just take what you be got. I'll what you take got. a mosquito ass chest. All big, breast, all big oh, breasted women say no. the same thing. And all I little, can never wear that cute top. All little boob bitches want big boobs, no, no, no. and all big boob Freeze bitches it. want. How you gonna try to come for me? You know, yes, I can't wear shirts, dresses. I can't do certain shit. I have to prep to wear a shirt. Okay, a mosquito <laughs> bitch can just throw that bitch on and be cute. I have to prep like two days advance. Like, what kind of bra I wear? Like, this and that. Like, I don't. Happy, I'll take a flat chest and a fat ass. Uh. As long as you ain't got ugly anyway. nipples, I don't care what size the motherfuckers is, okay? <laughs> Big, middle, grapefruit, uh, plum, I don't give a fuck what size the bows is. As long as you ain't got no ugly nipples. <laughs> now, the ugly <laughs> nipple bitches. <laughs> what nipples. do ugly nipples look like? Ugly nipple bitches I never are having seen. a tough oh, time out here. Oh, I have seen some. Like when the areola in the movie is like ridiculous. The motherfucking burnt I mean, cookies. Even if like it's... Like the big areola, that doesn't make it ugly, but just sometimes... Like, just like if your nipple just... The shape is odd. Out. Sometimes, sometimes she got like, small titties and the right. nipple is ninety percent. So it's just weird. And it's it, just weird. And even if you got an ugly nipple, you got a good soul, people. So <laughs> just, just go with that. You still beautiful inside, right? Baby. You still beautiful, but I, I'm, I'm, I'm more you're concerned. A black woman. As a man, I'm more concerned about what the fuck your nipple look like. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Cause I, cause it's not only just me. Like eventually, we talk about looking towards the future. My baby got to suck on them, and it's like, do I want to watch my again? Kids? Thinking about the kids. I want my kids to be in for a good time. When it's time to feed. Nipples for the rest of my wait, 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 wait. Let's speaking of kids and old conversations. Let's talk about the genetic shit. I'm gonna take it back to the genetic shit. Oh, because, part two of last yeah, episode. Because. It was the episode before. Because I said two episodes ago, I asked him, I said, are genetics important? Do you look at genetics? Like, do you look at your partner's parents and be like, that might be a problem? And I thought about it. I was like, women might do the same shit. I talked about, I said it towards women because it was mostly men on the pod. But. Do you want to talk kids? Yeah. Okay. Well, I don't want them tall. I just want them like. Not even that. Like, if you look, if you look at my pops. If they are tall, they could be a ball player. They could buy mama a house. Oh yeah, like uh, the way I say, it's weird. If I have like a a boy, I mean, I rather him tall. If I have like a girl, I, I mean, but I but no, that's average. not that's not I, what I'm talking about. I'm talking kid, about and if it's a boy, wait, we going to the NBA. But I mean, oh, but I mean if the bitches talk to me, but that, that's not the bill. That's what I'm talking about. I'm talking about like out as much as I should. You have. ever look at a dude's pops and then just be like, oh shit, male pattern baldness might be in this nigga family. So when you oh, get yeah. old, your hairline gonna recede. I gotta think about that. Yes, yeah, yeah. Your woman. Um, she I gotta think about my hairline. Receipt. Honestly, how relationship? Oh, you yeah. telling me my woman not gonna care about my hairline? I thought she was talking about hers. Well, doesn't I feel like I thought that was just all men. Like y'all shit gonna go back a bit as y'all get older. I think I think that's or, like, like <laughs> that's just I think, like proven. I think about genetic shit is just too much. Like 
at this rate, how millennials going, we just got to make sure our fucking relationship lasts. That's okay? <laughs> the fuck? Yeah. I don't give a fuck. Are you if happy, your, nigga? If your grandma yeah. got a limp, so I'm thinking about my kid having a limp. No, I'm just I trying to see if I can make kid, it with your bro, ass you know? all the way to fucking five <laughs> years from now, ho. Like I feel like oh, fuck it, oh, whore. Fuck it. You're like, hold fuck on, wait a minute. What the fuck wrong with your grandma? <laughs> <laughs> like, I just it sounds good. Is that going to happen to you when you get old? That's right. It sounds good, but ain't no nigga gonna be in love with a bitch. This Does that look like, running oh, your family? Nah. Hold on, wait a minute. You did not tell me your grandma had that. diabetes. Y'all got limps in y'all family. I can't even fuck with you. <laughs> no niggas gonna do that. Okay. So you gotta think about these things. Really? You gotta think about it, but it's like, it's like. It gotta be in the back of your mind. You gotta last first. Yeah, you're right. Lasting is very important Lasting nowadays. Is important. Cause don't shit last. Like even if my Nothing. kid, if my kid <laughs> end up with a fucked up limp, it's like at least I love your mama and we made it. You, <laughs> you gonna have a tough one, a little limp leg. I think that's leg. the most important thing little for me pee. when I have a kid, man. I want to be able to get along with the baby mama. Like no matter what happens between me and her, I want it to or be able to work. Or you should strive to have a baby mama. Yeah, you don't stay with her, bro. If you have a baby, baby mama, somebody, you're you gonna stay. Hold on, did you just say you're definitely gonna have a baby mama? I definitely want a baby mama. Why would I want? Why would I not want a baby? I'm saying, mama? why wouldn't you want to strive to have a wife, not a baby they, mama? Why, yeah, why you? I mean, stay I might with not her. get married, but I definitely want to get a baby mama. He just want a child. Okay, so you want a kid, but you don't know if you want to get married ever. No, I have no issue with being married. It's just more so my my thought process is I don't know who the fuck would even want to marry my. Okay, ass. I was oh. just saying, but that's why I'm saying you should strive to want a wife, not a baby mom. That's fine. Baby mom is cool though. They no, they're cool. Up, I'm just saying, like, drop you, you off know, snacks and shit. They be cool. Drop shit for the baby. Like I strive to have a husband, not baby father. I don't want like that. I want. I, I, I niggas was, out there, stop getting these fine motherfuckers pregnant. Save me a baby mama or a wife or some shit. Cause every time no, I go on Instagram, cause every time I go on Instagram, it'd be like my favorite bitches. Like, I'm 36 weeks. Fuck. So Gotta unfollow your pregnant. ass. I will now. say, bro. Good hey, for them. I'm look, actually listen, really happy for her. If yeah. you a baby mama or baby dad, whatever you are out there, are you a parent? don't be a bitter motherfucker. Don't be because this nigga did me wrong. I ain't gonna let him see my kids' ass. Oh, yeah, that's terrible. That's Don't horrible. be that person. Yeah, that should be kind of weird. Like, let your kids have a relationship with that, with your 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 baby dad. I don't get bro. why bitches use. Don't be kids lame. If you had <laughs> sex with him, it's okay like, for your kids to hang just out. Just because he don't want your. <laughs> they can at least hang out. Rubber ball <laughs> head ass. Just let him have a relationship with his kids bro and vice versa you bro. hung out with him and if you're a baby dad or baby mom don't bring lame people around your kids and your other person don't approve it you know, like yeah, if, if i got a baby mama and it's like we cool but you got a lame ass <laughs> boyfriend who do lame ass <laughs> shit around my kid like you, kids are very impressionable right like don't mm, i don't want my no kid coming home to my house doing my some kids. lame shit this is why hopefully I have you got this from your and daddy I'm, and i'm an aries so I'm, pe- I'm petty like don't be teaching my kid how to do fucking math the period. way i don't want him doing math period Nigga, why if the fuck I come you carry the here shit and like he, that and he adding math and shit like melvin ass <laughs> Period. I didn't teach him that. Keep Melvin Period. away from my motherfucking kid when he learned his math. Period. Okay? I want him to add like that. Who taught you how to do this long division? Right. Melvin. <laughs> Nigga. Right. <laughs> Fuck Melvin. We gonna be out there and have smoke. Fuck this Melvin math. Melvin. 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 Melvin, if you with my baby mom, just fuck my baby mom. Don't raise my child. As okay? a fellow He's Aries, good. I agree. Yeah, it's off my kid. Act, act like my say, child is I really want have that, see him. that woman on you. Want. I really want to. I just hope I have a husband because I don't want to deal with that. That shit, I don't want to. Having right. a lame bitch around my kid. Yo, have you ever been like? Have right. you oh ever pulled God. up? I have you ever? Have As you ever, a woman, she teaching your kid how to do her that. hair all wrong, edges gone, just fuck up. Every time, oh have y'all ever pulled up to the grocery store and you see like a baby exchange going on in the parking lot? Oh, yes. yes. <laughs> <laughs> the baby dad, you yes. just, yeah, I just, I be that. feeling for them. Like, Every Damn. time I see that shit, is going wrong. Cause though. the baby get in the car and then they outside talking. Yeah. And you can just feel it's the about bad about to vibes. be an argument. It's always at a Walmart. It's always, it's a, always at a Walmart. Right next to where they selling puppies. Done. Oh, always you mean on that back, <laughs> that back area? <laughs> always in the damn puppies. No, at the top of the neighborhood. At the, no, top, the, of the top, top of the, top of the parking, parking lot. lot. Right. Oh, the Walmart. Oh, my. Away, away from everybody like else. At my Walmart, they sell the puppies. Like. And he always got a car that don't need a baby seat in it. Yeah. It's Done. like you got a whole hell cat. Uh, Why are you trying to squeeze a? I saw a nigga. I saw somebody <laughs> try to throw a fucking the i eight, the BMW. Right, they're putting the baby stroller. I'm like, what the Come fuck, on, nigga? nigga? Are you serious? 
Hey, you know. nigga, if you got a kid, get a car prep for your kid, please. <laughs> if you, you know you got a I eight, nigga, you can get right. a photo vehicle. Uh, nigga. Right, get you a sedan, nigga. <laughs> for the damn, damn kid. Damn, nigga, struggling with the just two for door a couple miles, years, right. so the stroller, the, yeah, the seat man. can be in the back. So your, your monster. This is random because, like I said, Tiana said he's pregnant, but I'm kind of sad because I really want to fucking see that sex tape. I want to see a ta- like Taylor and Iman sex tape really bad. I feel like that should be I way. I feel like I, I would. I would. That I should like be, be demeaning. I'd be like, yo, they're having, <laughs> they're having way better sex. No, I, f- I feel like it'd be great. Yes. Like it has to be amazing. Both I, of them are right there athletic. It's be amazing. Peak. Yeah, like I'm like I'm sure this nigga is incredibly strong. I'm saying he's probably picking and her so up. So is she. Right. right. They're probably doing <laughs> her aerobatic <legs>. shit. Because <laughs> watching her do that like little lap dance thing on him, that video that went around. Her legs are impeccable. I, I was like, yeah. I don't ever want to watch. I don't we ever want to watch a sex tape and be like, I can't. I need the tape. <laughs> <laughs> you ever watch a sex tape and get depressed? Like, damn, that nigga. Tam right, and Iman, like, yeah, we need the tape. Nigga, I need the tape. I can't do this. Yes, bitch. Go back. Go back. Go back to the search. <laughs> right, like, I need a. I need a new video. <laughs> this is unobtainable. Like, why are both their <laughs> upper body strength? This that is like way strong? off topic, but I have to ask because that shit's funny to me, or it's interesting to me. Like, okay, because Tiana I announced she was pregnant, and so people think Nikki's pregnant. Cause of a picture she posted, she did look kind of pregnant by who? Her baby daddy in jail, her, or her whoever the nigga, the the potential baby daddy. Who? Oh, he's still in jail. I, he was I don't know. I, don't he, I hope he's still he in jail. But either Pervert. way, I people think that she's <laughs> go ahead. Go and crazy. Like I said, with the perfect thing, people were just like, because you know she did the song with Six Nine. Yeah, another one. And, and like Bob. even Barb's were kind of, and you know Barb's defend her to the end. To the deal. Even some of them were like, girl. <laughs> Like, why do you keep purposely like? You don't make my job <laughs> easy, bitch. <laughs> why? Like, I why do you a keep fan, purposely? But you're I just wonder why she keeps doing it. Like, why do you keep purposely putting yourself around like terrible people? Child molesters. Like, he molested it. children too. Well, that was hmm? the first case. When that was, uh, yeah, the girl oh, yeah, lied about her age, and he was playing with her titties. Oh. Yeah, yeah, he didn't even have so sex I, with her, but he was playing with her. Titties. And I know some people are like, "Well, she lied, okay." She so. did lie about her age. She admitted about lying, and he was playing with her titties. Okay, but her husband though. For it. Yeah, that's it. Her husband though <laughs> is a different story. I think her husband actually straight out just did that shit. Like, yeah, he, he the, like, the, the, the boyfriend straight up raped somebody. Yeah, like for real. Oh, for that's what he in jail. So yeah, she dated a rape. Well, he's in jail yeah. for well, some like probation. probation. Shit. This this nigga had a knife up to show that he was back. Jail for rape and, probation. Yeah, yeah. Basically. He already had raped the motherfucker. Yeah, he was on rape probation. He was on rape probation. He was doing he, like he was like leaving the I think country he left and the shit. State. Yeah, whatever. Yeah. After you rape somebody, that nigga was in Africa. Caught, like turn your life yeah, around, bro. Yeah. Like, is he even supposed to be around kids? Turn your no. fucking life they went around. to a whole school in Africa. I feel like niggas was like, nigga, you need to be a hundred thousand feet away from school. <laughs> but you know what's funny? After after him getting arrested for that, seeing him in the video, how the he meal? no, how he acted in the video made sense because he was like sneaking, like he looked I'm like he looked real klepto, like he, he was, was sneaky motherfucker. He was like trying to get around. He sees me, right? <laughs> 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 trying to be incognito right Either way, now. but it's just like Nikki's just doing interesting things. And I just wanted to bring it up because like that's just Oh, quick thing about kids look. though. Um, are y'all prepared to be grandparents? How the fuck? How the fuck okay, cool. Know, so when you when you <laughs> become a grandparent, like, so when you become a grandparent, what would you like your grandkids to call you? Like pop pop, oh, nana, grandma? Like, Whatever they want to call me, I don't give a damn. Cause I hate. Yeah. I was just talking I about just this other day with my mom. That. I hate grandma. I was like, I don't do know how to feel about grandma. I'm gonna get called like grandma. I'm oh. Like bitch. I All hate right, next that topic. Shit. Next topic. I'm That's sorry. I mean, I, uh, that that really just pissed I me off. I, grandma. I, I know. I got fuck? you. I got you. Bitch is really. Do I don't that. want grand in my name. You can call me Pop Pop or like. Yeah, that's what I'm holes. saying. I like Pop Pop. I don't want Grand in my name. Don't I call don't. me Grand unless I'm doing the fake ass karate shit. So don't you know. call me Grand unless I'm a karate master. Yeah. Like, the fake ass hoes of Patrice and Sasha. They had a whole secret time without me, so yeah. you know. Them niggas was sleeping in my bed. Why they come out looking nervous? Yeah. Okay. Well, what was y'all I think doing? we've been in Fred's been room long enough. Shit. What y'all been doing? <laughs> they came out mad nervous. Both their faces red, and that's crazy because Patrice dark. They was watching right. pornography together. Yeah, I, mm-hmm. I got them porn. though. I got y'all though. I'm gonna be keeping secrets was, all rest of July. Day. Someone took it out the book bag. Yeah. Oh God! Put your dick up. Hey, while I'm here, man, I wanna uh, share this. Um, well, 
Back in the day, my mom had this uh goddamn candle business, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. She had started. But because she had me and my sister, she had to real slow down. On plug, 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 plug. Beep, 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 beep. Yeah, I had to plug this shit in. But because I'm of age now, um, I'm bringing it back, man. I'm about to be selling candles, man. They're going to be infused with cannabis oil. They're going to get you oh. right, man. When I drop CBD? this shit. Yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Fred, oh, yeah. Yeah, oh, CBD. Nigga, I fucking got a pedicure. It's gonna be relaxing. Shit, yes, that man. shit. Relaxing. Hey, true Real. Colors Atlanta. True Colors Atlanta candles. That's what they it's called. Man, I'm finna drop that shit, man. Y'all shot with me. You man. heard it here. True Colors. You heard First. It. You heard it the okay. fuck here, nigga. True that colors. shit gonna be hard. Hey, we can get the candle. We can put on the table. We can. True Colors. Right. We can, we can zen out. That right. would be lit. I'm gonna send y'all one, man. I'll be it's too calm. Me. I'll be too calm. All right, the first candle is gonna be the Janae candle. It's gonna be based off of Janae. Um, she is very relaxing. She is relaxing. <laughs> We're gonna do the color scheme from our album, man. It's gonna Yellow. get you relaxed, yeah, man. Mm. Mango coconut milk. You know Ooh. what I'm saying? It's gonna be it sound like real luxury. <laughs> it's gonna be different, man. Y'all, 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 stay tuned for that. How the fuck is there coconut milk and coconut water? <laughs> Amen. All right, sorry, random. Sorry. No, 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 uh, no, no. That's good. That's a good. That's, that's a valid shit. question. That's some hot shit. They put cream. Does it? Does it just? Does it, I don't know what they do. I that don't know. Some hot shit. How does it turn uh, into coconut? Or they coconut take milk? out the water. I don't know what they do. Or if the water sit. No, the because once you cut open a water watermelon, once you cut cut open a coconut, that's water on the inside. Right. Where does the milk come? They in? put the cream somewhere. They add cream. What type sure, of cream? Yep. I don't fucking know. Coconut cream, nigga. I don't know. <laughs> That a cream. Was a, that was a valid I don't know. No, they probably take they probably take like the flakes, like the white inner wall mm-hmm. of the coconut, uh, and they, they probably cr- like grind it creamify up. that shit. That makes sense. Nasty. That, that makes sounds sense. More creamified. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Creamify. Coconut does a lot of things. <laughs> <laughs> creamify. Hey, I'm not, I'm not. I don't know why that's funny. Creamify. Not a chemist. I'm about to use that. Creamify. <laughs> so what, what, so hey, girl, you try, no, how do y'all? Feel, <laughs> oh God. How do y'all feel about the state of music right now, like the music industry? And where is that? Um, who, you, f- who do y'all feel like is pushing the envelope? I don't know. Pushing the envelope? I, honestly, I, don't know if I can't even I mean, answer that question. Technically, right pushing the envelope would technically be Lil Baby. I'm about to say, mm. boy, you heard that shit, that new shit. Yeah. Talking yeah. about technically, real Technically, it's oh, Lil Baby Freddy if you had to answer yeah. that question mm. right now. I think he deserves a Grammy this year. He, yeah. yep. I think so. He's been putting in a lot of work, yeah. for sure. He would get a Grammy if nobody else comes out with a Did major you, album. <laughs> there was a tweet. Right. Someone was like, "Little baby talking about real <laughs> issues now. You're done, nigga." And they mentioned Kendrick. Right. <laughs> I was like, "Whoa!" Why would you do that? Whoa! Why would you do that? Whoa! Let's but slow down. I'm happy, That's y'all, y'all I'm happy we, that the niggas talking about real issues. Y'all remember but when whoa. we thought like Little Baby and Gunna was neck and neck? No. I, had a, like, I had to talk with somebody. They said they like Gunna better. That. I don't know. I think oh, Lil no. Baby then. I think when Lil Baby never started dropping that. them slow jams, I think Lil Baby then motherfucking surpassed Gunna. Yeah, yeah. Gunna oh, has sure. yet to do anything for the ladies yet. Yeah. And it's I don't know if he meant like Gunna has a very consistent like, sound. Yeah, I don't know who else. I think he meant like maybe he just likes Gunna better. But I was like, Lil Baby is definitely more successful. Um, I feel. I'm not gonna <laughs> hold y'all. I'm probably about to get some people text me mad about this when I say this, but. I do not like Rod Wave. What? what is Rod? His music makes me sad. Who? Oh, Rod Wave. Okay, yeah. yeah. But I, 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 w- I would say he's pushing so. the envelope. Like, you ain't never seen his a nigga music, sing like he in a choir his music, or trap music. His music make me feel sad. He talks about being betrayed all, all the time. <laughs> all the yeah. time. But so yeah. does the weekend and Drake sad ass. And I don't listen to them either. You're right. He, I well, he's right. love yeah. Drake. That's you. And even with Drake, at or least sometimes. Like you. So you don't like Drake either? <laughs> so you don't like Drake either? You're a Drake uh, hater too? Nah, I fuck. I know that Working on weekends like usual. I fuck with Drake. <laughs> we connect. I'm so dumb. Okay. That was the lie. Him, we okay. in the same room. <laughs> no, I definitely. I got no issues with Drake. Y'all don't, you don't listen to the weekend? I'm no, not. He's sad. I'm not bro. a fan. I don't like him. Not a fan. I did not like I respect, no, I respect no, no. the weekend. I understand, you know what he doing. Even and his early like shit, that. y'all didn't. Oh, it was cool. It was alright. It, cool. it was cool. It just wasn't for me. The know, only depressed nigga I like listening to is Kid Cudi. 
Done. Yes. Yeah. Yes. And Kid Cudi, because Kid Cudi got a different way of doing depressed. Yeah. He's like, we gonna get through this shit. Yeah. He be like, we depressed, but nigga, you still great. Right. Like, nigga, we gonna like, be amazing, true. nigga. I fuck with that Kid this nigga Cudi made a song called "Unfuckwittable." Right. I don't give a fuck what you say. We can't get you depressed and just leave you there. Like, oh, right. Yeah. He make you want to be like, damn, nigga, I'm still sad. Right. Like, <laughs> He's yeah. like, it's okay. Sniff some coke. You left me <laughs> down here. That's true. No, niggas doing whippets now. Kid Kid Cudi is that shit, Mr. Rager. Whoa. Kid Cudi is definitely my top. Who y'all top five? Oh my god! Just not artists in general. Not even rappers, <laughs> this question singers, hasn't been asked in a while. Just in general, bro. That's a hard. Somebody five. asked that today too because they were like, "Is Future in the in your top ten? No, I'm probably more prepared for this question. I'm not okay. at all. But I'm gonna give the you slightest. Pharrell. Pharrell. I'm gonna give you Tyler the Creator. Uh huh. Just as an artist, like just out of everything he does, yeah, you know, even with the period. clothes and shit. Right. Um. Right. I'm gonna go ahead and say Kanye. You know he did his little donation, so it's it's fair <laughs> to say Kanye. Oh yeah, Kanye's back. Niggas, we fuck with him now. Woo, yeah, he's back. Kanye is back, so I'm gonna throw Kanye up there. Um, I'm gonna do Most Def because I didn't. I've, I've I've discovered Most Def slow jams, and boy, they're they're yeah, they're amazing. Um, and fifth, I would probably say Erica Badu. Uh, probably man. just you know diversify. You one of them niggas oh, that like in mountain and shit. I don't, but I love me. Okay. I'm the nigga who likes incense. Yeah, he he the incense nigga, but you don't I like love incense? me. Erica, I do like incense. Oh, come on, I just don't be buying. Attempt the top five. He be buying. Attempt, it. Like, give me three. I ain't even gonna say five. Three. Like it artists, don't even gotta be in order. Artist, just artist. Ooh, any fuck. Genre, I, any I gotta genre. say, Flying Lotus. I know that's not five, but Flying Lotus too. Man, damn. Because my and Mac my, Miller. my music, the things that I like in music is like a, it's a weird spectrum. It goes from rap to jazz. Hey, go. So, just artists, bro. Artists. artists. So as far as artists go, That's who creates the best a, I ain't even want to put a category. The best art for me, Sonic. Big Crit, Sade, uh-huh. uh, uh, Herbie Hancock. Uh-huh. Ah, shit. Two more. Hmm. Hmm. Um, Marvin Gaye, for sure. Uh-huh. Oh, and MF do. That nigga. For me. See, that's, that's where it gets tricky. It gets tricky. Because I like Wu-Tang Clan. Ooh. As a whole, Method. I'm not. I'm not even going to say individual. Method but if man. I was going to say individual, Method Man, he's not. He's, well, he's. It's between Method Man and uh and Method Raekwon. Man. I hate to stop you, but did y'all watch that show? I not in. I haven't show. watched it. What show? Y'all oh, gotta the, watch um, it. Wu Tang New Saga. Dude, yeah, good. I haven't it's watched it. Good. It's actually good. But continue. My but that's out. That was five. I'm done. Right, who your five? Give us something. Now. <laughs> Come on, Who do you listen something. to on the daily? <laughs> I mean, I feel like that's some basic shit. I feel like I, I'm just cl- the cliche line. I feel like I just listen to like a lot of different shit. But um, who have I been listening to lately? It ain't even lately. Just if you know they're gonna drop some shit, you know. If without you know a doubt, they drop, you you're pressing, you're hitting the link in the bio. <laughs> you gonna be waiting on that motherfucker? That's to drop, a, that's right? a real that's hard question, why? man. Like, saying, ooh, like, ooh, schoolboy Q. Because okay. there's a lot. I'll I'll take Flatbush uh, zombies and Kendrick okay, Lamar. I'll do schoolboy Q. Kendrick too. The internet. Uh huh. The internet the for internet. sure. Yeah, they are great. Damn, the internet's great. Uh, exactly. Is, um, can I have a five though? No, can I have five, a five right? tier two? Like, <laughs> do a tier two. Fuck it. We on here. Who am I pressing? Okay, because don't judge me. Be sure you know Rihanna. Drake. I'm pressing Drake automatically. I don't give a fuck. Okay, we Drake. know that. That's fair. You know. We know <laughs> that. We know Drake that. Drake going to be in somebody list. Right. Drake going to be in somebody top five. For sure. Yeah, I don't. He's he's just pretty up there. Um, Let's see. Who else? That's like three. Um, Who else could I like think of? Um, hmm. See, it's complicated. It is. It's hard as fuck. Yeah, because like, there's just so just, much out there. It's listen, too much. There's a lot of content. And Katrin, not a wow. Oh, yeah, that's a good one. Oh, I, I feel like I listen to like a, a lot of white. Man, music. do you be you, man? People call it white music, you know? Man, call that uh, name. Uh, <laughs> say, that lower. Name. say that name, bro. White be music. you. Um, What's that white girl named? Billy. <laughs> Billy English. Eilish. Eilish. She's cool. <laughs> I like Billie her. Eyelash. I don't think <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I'm like automatically running for her shit. But I mean she's good. I like I enjoy her voice. I, I am in, I am amazed at how she got seven Grammys in one year. Yeah, that shit was wild. Huh? Yeah. I yeah. just like her voice because I feel sure, like we haven't yeah. had like a super newcomer moody type voice like she has. Like I think it's been a minute, so I feel like that's why she kinda took the industry by storm the way she did. You know what I'm realizing? I'm starting to notice that not as many people as I thought know about Killer Mike. That's See, crazy. Yes, that's yeah. that's true. Killer Mike. 
That nigga's an Atlanta legend. He is. Yeah. Like, bro, I've been watching his new show. Do you mean like Atlanta folk don't know about him or like people in general? Killer Mike got the best show on Netflix right now. I'll throw it out there. (laughs) (laughs) Okay. If you didn't watch, yeah, it's one, it's one of my favorites. You need to go watch on Netflix. Shit. For sure. Killer Mike, okay. a real ass nigga. Like everything that Ti thinks he is Done. is what Killer, Killer Mike, Mike is. is. Done. Right. This nigga said this is Wakanda. Why would you say that? <laughs> Gotta protect it. Such a terrible on television. And walked off like yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like I, I said, said that it. Shit. He thought that was a drop <laughs> the mic moment. The top five. Woo, that was funny. Yeah, okay, what about your top five? Killer right. Mike in my top five. Oh, I would throw Kid Cudi in my shit too. Yeah, I got it. Five, I got I got to do Kid Cudi for sure. I'm gonna say Future. I was gonna say Future, but I didn't want to be like basic. I've recently, uh, I'm recently <laughs> starting to. Future, future. I didn't want to be basic, but Future dropped some shit. I'm future. gonna go listen to it. No, All man, right, Kid Cudi, I'm bad Future. I like future so much. I'm gonna say <laughs> Brent Fires. Oh, oh yeah, that <laughs> nigga. Oh, that nigga. Brent Fires is different. Good I list. just don't like how he be so aggressive, but be sounding sweet. <laughs> He do be saying some pretty like um that's so funny. <laughs> I, I had to say Janae because she she definitely Ico. that's a good one, yeah. Yeah. So that's the girl know. that tatted Big Sean, right? She you don't know who Janae is. Yes. You don't know who That's the girl that tatted Big Sean, right? Yeah, but yeah. why are you saying it like that's her only identifier? Am I wrong? I mean, no, but people don't like ideas. Why did y'all get quiet? Because I asked if she like did her. something she actually did. Because okay. that's the wildest but thing to point out to, about right, her. To identify her. That's what I'm saying. That's well, that's a her wild ID. thing to do. I'm sorry. But that's yeah, not right. her identifier. Like, no one else has done it. Like, is that that girl that did that? Like, yeah, what? like Janae Aigo. Like, you, no one you else say, is, like, oh. Nobody like, else got Big Sean tatted on their okay, face. Okay, but okay. do you not see what I'm saying? Like, you <coughs> Or not her face, but you know. <laughs> it's like you're diminishing. Like, that's not like big wait, face. That's wait, 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 wait. Time the fuck out. She got a tattoo on her face? Not on her no. face, but it's his face. It's and it's like on her arm or yeah, something. Yeah, it is. Oh. Man, they're I not even together. It. They're not even together, and it, she know. just got this nigga face. Yeah, don't, black people don't do dumb shit. Man. She, is she, she black? It? She covered it. Is she With what? Her? Oh yeah, she did change. A it. band. A phoenix. A phoenix. A phoenix. Big Sean is a phoenix now. A phoenix. Mm. I don't think yeah. I, I he always like, comes back. That's to symbolic. Her. I feel like I have to. Yeah. He's I know evolved he's doing his list. I feel like I have to finish my list, and I'm gonna throw some white people in there. Okay, for the my like last two. Green Day. Nah. I do like Green. Mm. Nah. See, 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 we nah. get close. We get close. <laughs> <laughs> I give you red hot chili peppers. I do. Like I like them. them. Um, like okay, because I had my little fucking who do my arrow with them Paramore. We can't really. Paramore, we, 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 Paramore, nah, Paramore. I'm gonna Paramore. let you rock. I'm and then my fucking Nirvana. Going. We gotta check. Not. We gotta she make sure. Who, we gotta check those people and see if they made a BLM statement. Oh God. He's a heartbreaker. Never mind. Huh? Never mind. I'm listening I'm to it like, what are you talking about? I don't know. Y'all know who, one. man, come I on. I probably do know. They said Thundercat. Say it ain't so. That's Y'all not Thundercat. Well, I'm sampling that. Whoever the fuck sampled that. <laughs> and then, like I said, my sampling last, that, my last out of the box. I'll credit them when you sample it. I like fucking Slipknot because <laughs> I like, I do like Screamo, so I'll. Oh, you Interesting. like that? I, I can't get into that. Okay, shit. what do you get out of that? I just want to know. I need to find a. Mo- oh. There's no mood for that shit. Like, what do you do? After I, I gotta fight. I gotta fight. I gotta be I punching. I gotta be punching someone. Nobody. Like, I what do you, like literally? What you do telling you get me out of that? punching oh. someone in? Wait, no, 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 Brittany. Oh, okay. This is important. Because what, what do you uh, get out of listening? No, no, no. Like people screaming. What I get out of listening? Uh I mean, I I generally feel like it has like. I genuinely feel like it has a beat. Like I, I, yeah. I feel like I can like what? rock to the shit. Like uh-huh. it has a beat, just like rap does. I uh-huh. feel like you can, even though I mean, they're screaming. There, there's interest. Right. There's instruments. Yes. I mean, right. yeah, but I feel like some people are like this. Just sounds like a whole bunch of noise, and it's just like a lot. Like I mean, I don't know. It's just some of them. My thing. Some some are too some are too much because all uh-huh. screamo can't screamo can't get <laughs> too much. Like what's, that, what's that show on the Do Swim? Metalopolis? Me- Metalopolis? Yeah. Ma- Metalopolis? But then Metalop- there's Screamo that's like Do more you so like that show? The fuck? Okay, it ain't the 4th of July. <laughs> and, uh, they busting. What was that? They trying to keep the rent down. <laughs> so we just heard gunshots real quick. I don't know for sure, but um, Screamo, I mean, like I said, I genuinely enjoy it. I'm not saying it relaxes me. I mean, it's just like kind of like listening to <laughs> trap music. I don't know why like, you would say it relaxes you. I didn't. 
I mean, some people. I wonder what they engineers go through. Like you gotta mix and master. No headphones. And now you hear. (laughs) 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 No headphones. Niggas is just turning knobs. Like wow, okay, that's maybe. So you know, you know how you pass the screaming. You know how you go on Apple Music. Good oh, it's lyrics. a message in them screens. I mean, what, yeah, really? that's all about to I say. didn't think that had words. No, I, I, I was just about, was just I was just about to say like I wonder how if you go on Apple Music, you know how when you hit like the lyrics, lyrics thing on Apple right. Music, it says like the lyrics and then goes to the next one, then goes to the next one. Right. I wonder how it looks on Screamo. That shit like, says they're dot, legit, dot, dot. <laughs> they're legit saying words. It's Those just, might be firecrackers. They still busting? They're yeah. Those are firecrackers. They're legit saying words in Screamo. They're just yelling. Them. Yeah, it's just weird. They they're yelling a certain word in a weird way. Like this word. Okay. Hey, it's music, it's art. Um, somebody got <laughs> somebody fucking shit. with it. Okay, let's rewind this whole conversation. Let's talk about current shit. So, be Simone, <laughs> bruh. What did, what did she Her do? book. What Lol. And then the nine to five. No, it's not a book. It's a magazine. No, that shit is. I'm like, I was really hoping. Like, does it really look like that? I was like, I hope not, because like. <laughs> when they said, when they said, that's what she was doing at three in the morning, gluing pages together. <laughs> I fucking died. Oh my god. Who in the audience likes B Simone? Nobody. All y'all niggas be talking like one her. body. Nobody. Stand up. Nobody. One body. Can the real slim shake Even money. Even money like B Simone. Even money. One body. Why do you like B Simone? Face like she like it. I genuinely want to know. I don't agree with what she's saying. What business do you have? <laughs> but no, I'm saying like, why do you uh-huh. like her? You're an entrepreneur, right? Oh, those are firecrackers. I mean, I think she's, she's okay. I actually didn't have a problem with her, Pooh, you like but Simone. she kind of, you know, said some bird shit. Huh? I mean, yeah, bitches like love yeah, be, her. Yeah, when I see videos of her talking, I'd be like, I already know that's gonna be too loud. Yeah, yeah, yeah like a lot of women love her. If you can just like, do the voice over in your own head. <laughs> I don't think what? she's bad. She yeah, she is. I don't okay. No, she not. Okay, I was saying before the comments, I didn't think she was. I was like, you know, okay, like she's. This nigga done. F- she was just kind of there. This whole quarantine, every time she talks, she say the wrong thing. I just yes. kind of like the way she says the baby girl. I just like that. She I don't fuck know up why. like Trina did. Trina yeah, I like that. Yeah, no, that Trina but was a big. That one. nine to five yeah. bullshit. Trina really fucked up. She fucked and you know it's crazy. Like days before that whole shit, I was trying to give Trina props. To, like to my, I was having a musical conversation with somebody, and I was trying to like, man, people don't give Trina enough respect. And then that weekend, she apologized. She is some dumb, <laughs> shit. dumb shit. I'm like, well, D-S. there goes some my, there goes shit. my credit. She did apologize. That's what I'm saying. She didn't apologize. Okay, she just well, explained. explained. Okay. Bro, and that's, what I, that's what I was trying to say last episode. That's what I. Thank you. That's what I was saying the last episode. Don't apologize. Just, like don't apologize. Don't don't just, don't 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 just explain what you mean. Yeah. Just explain what you mean. Accept it, bro. I feel like when you first say something, you don't even mean it. Yeah. That's how you really felt. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. That's true. Like don't even go back and apologize. That's first instinct. It's in your frontal lobe. But you can go back and look at how you felt and what you said at something and realize that it was wrong. And then at that point, not necessarily wrong. Just just probably just, I probably said that wrong because I if you're gonna sit there and say everything I ever say in my life is right, you're a righteous person. And that's just that is, that's just wrong. I'm just saying, don't come back. Right. Don't this let your next statement come out to be I'm sorry for what I said. No, you wasn't. Yeah, yeah I don't. No. Yeah, I kind of agree. You said with it because no, don't right. say it. Don't say it. Don't say it immediately after. You know, take some time to think about it and realize. I just like with some situations that you fucked up. Like with this situation and like apologize. The climate we're in. I just want to say that I said that last episode. It's just and niggas some just shit looked at me sense. like I was crazy. That, uh, just because one other person said it doesn't mean it's right. I agreed with Fred last episode, and then Trina, like I said, <clears> you <throat> dumbass talking about some <clears> old. These <throat> <laughs> <laughs> niggas is really just <laughs> hold on, they let that bitch just ride. <laughs> <laughs> oh my mama! Are to they, freedom. Are they pretty? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I like you see them at least. Oh, y'all can see fireworks. Yeah. It's June. He's letting this shit off. It's June twelfth. It's, it's June twelfth. That chopper sang. It's not even a holiday. Is is it a holiday? It's somebody's birthday. It's not a holiday. Probably. It's, it's Valentine's Day in Brazil. Get the, the fuck, fuck out of here. Why do you oh, know so that? They're Brazilian. They're Brazilian. That's what's going on. <laughs> we love it. <laughs> but I was trying to say, Trina's saying that shit in this climate. Like, y'all running around like animals and da da da. Like, Trina. Like, I just feel like. Like at what point is common car hoods in front of <laughs> at what point is common sense not man? I was gonna say at what point is common sense not common like <laughs> you're calling black people tree. animals running around and whatever the fuck you were saying like girl it's tough out here. No. Hey, hey I wanna go out here and say this I'm gonna say this on the record 
rich black people treat us just like white folks. Oh yeah, for sure. For the most part, even yeah. worse. Just like Africans. I'm telling you, you run to a black rich motherfucker, he gonna treat you worse than a white person. Oh my mom. Facts. It's really truthful. Though. I used to. Do I, that's why I try to say. I used to do door to door sales. <laughs> that's why I try to. Me too. That's why I try to say rich people in general rich are wild. Treat like you worse than all of them person. are wild. They do some crazy shit. No matter what race or yeah. age, co- nothing. Mm. They, if you rich, you want some wild shit. Yeah. Oh, of course, right. And but I, I mean, like, I feel like it come with it because to get rich, you saying. had to slime somebody out. You had to, to put, get to the point where you, you at on the way up. You gotta make. You, you gotta, gotta fuck make, somebody you else's life up. You gotta fuck somebody over, and that sticks. One hundred percent. Rich people, you gotta fuck somebody over to get rich. And you that's got just, to. Period. It's no way to live wholesome and just and period. be rich. <laughs> period. <laughs> There's no way, bro. Doctors. <laughs> Doctors. You benefiting off death, nigga. Patrice, you the worst. Patrice don't agree. You don't think You don't agree. She shook her head. Not unless you come up on a lottery. Nah, she didn't. She don't disagree. Get, she just never realized, and it's hitting her. It's just hitting her now. But I she like, like, damn, they right. If you work to get rich, you fuck somebody over, bro. You got to. That's the only way. It's nothing but evil yeah. at the time. I try not to think like that, but it's kind of true. It's Ooh. called a ladder. Rich people are Who gotta is climb rich that ladder. and is not fucking somebody over? Name one person. I can tell you right now, somebody who's not LeBron James is rich. Outside of winning he the lottery. He me over and all Chicago Bull <laughs> fans everywhere. Okay. Oh, my, Michael Jordan, the slime ball. <laughs> that nigga there is a slime ball. I was actually ball. really shook that this nigga came out and said something. Michael this Jordan? nigga is a grease ball. I watched that this little nigga documentary. Don't, this nigga don't say <laughs> shit about anything this political. This nigga was mad at Scotty for not playing. Scotty was broke. <laughs> nigga, my parents <laughs> were mad at that back. shit too. It's spinal. My, it's, like, it's a spinal injury. Nigga, my <laughs> parents were mad that shit too. They were this, like, nigga, what? Like, you, you bro, getting all the money. Of course you, you ain't got no complaints. <laughs> like, this nigga Michael was making more off shoes right. than Scotty was making. That's not Michael's fault. Hand. That's not Michael's fault. But I'm saying his understanding, and he's like, he should have still played and did this. <laughs> Sir. <laughs> nigga, we like trying he, to get this championship. Talking about he shouldn't have did it the way he did it. I this is what we're doing it for. I want to win. But like I said, I try to give him benefit of the doubt. Is like because Michael had that mentality, like play no matter what, win no matter what. Like that's because if him. Michael Jordan was in that situation, like he would have played. Yeah, he probably would. Man, he probably yeah, sick. he, he would have for sure. Sick. But not everyone has that mentality. He, my nigga he Scott, ain't gonna ask my nigga you to Scotty do so back do. was about to collapse. Get in the game, Scotty. What and that's not do? to diminish because Michael Jordan would have got his ass in the game if his whole back. And that's not to diminish Scotty doing anything he did but i'm just saying it's you just have two different say. you have two different it's easy to size say of the store yeah. of the world, and nigga had the flu it's not even size of the store you just have two different virus. you just have two different mentalities was, okay yeah two different mentalities like for sure like but mike was a dick <laughs> <It> was, <laughs> right. some of the shows like damn like yeah, he knows he's on. a dick too he was like hey man i did what i had to do isaiah thomas was one of the greatest the fact that he came out all time he was a and dick too asked him out the dream team he was a dick too because yeah, other was. dicks don't like other dicks. The fact that he came out before I, I, the documentary. As a man with a penis, I will say, right. I don't like dick. It's just like, so. yeah. Before. <laughs> I don't. I don't. But it's before like, he came, I mean, Michael warned us, though. He said he was worried about niggas seeing him in a negative different light. <laughs> yeah, Mike, you fucked up, man. But I don't see him. I really don't see him hey, in a negative Scotty light. Scotty was about to be in a cardboard box but under, that, a, under a bridge. But guess and what? you mad at him not going to practice? I, I, going I back, can't pay my bill. Going back to what we said, rich people, successful people, <laughs> got to fuck over somebody it's to true. get he successful. fucked over Scotty Pippen. I don't think he, he fucked over Scotty. He, he fucked over more than just Scotty. I don't think he, he fucked over Scotty. Fucked Carl Malone, I mean, John Stockton. Okay, but how did he fuck over Scotty though? Like, what was what was he gonna do? I mean, he could have limited Scotty got six rings too. I'm yeah. saying, like, what did he really do? But Michael damn, didn't. Nigga, Michael didn't do nothing, damn, Scotty. Let me a band. Let me get a goddamn. <laughs> can we do a joint shoe? That's what I'm saying. You're like, you should. He should have given money. Mike, you know I'm broke. Let's do a joint what, pippin shoe. What the fuck uh, is a joint shoe? I mean, do you really feel and like you should have given money? You trying to get them Jordan pippins? I mean, I didn't give him money. Trying but to get help them Jordan pippins. Them shit might be hard though. Let me throw me in one of them commercials. You know I'm broke. The pippins was alright. He could have got. At the same time, Scotty was going broke. Michael was shooting Space Jam. Why wasn't Scotty in the movie? Put me in the movie. I'm broke. He could have at least been one of the motherfuckers who got their powers took. Right. You know what I'm saying? Can I be a yeah. monster or some shit? Shit. I'll be a monster. I'm going broke. Might as well be a monster. <laughs> okay, so after. <laughs> no, no, no. About to say Charles this. Barkley. After fucking. They oh, Charles. <laughs> Charles ain't going broke. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going broke, Mike. Charles got MVP that year. What the fuck, Mike? 
<laughs> Charles and Cora, bro. bro. Charles and I will Peter say, here. watching that shit. So it was like the little like manager. I'm like, now after watching the shows, like, was that Jerry Krause? Like the little yeah, green most manager? Yeah, definitely. Because I was Jerry like, that looked just Jerry like Krause. that nigga. I was like, without Ooh. a doubt. Yeah, Once I watched Krause. it, I was like, wow. And nigga Michael Jordan's like, draw yeah. him <laughs> like this. Right. No, like, make him shorter, wow. not short enough. Matter of fact, I'm gonna give you not a picture. Shorter. Scotty was coming <laughs> off. Make him yeah. even Scotty, shorter. Scotty was coming off an MVP season. Give him a that cigar. Was, Michael made this. What I think he did. He make Space Jam the year he retired or some shit. Michael Jordan was he filming? Oh, he was about to come back or some shit. I don't know. I, think I know he was, right. he was just playing yeah, baseball. Was, I know, that was I know, while he was coming back. Right, and I know Scotty had oh, yeah, what, an MVP ready, season yeah. that year, yeah. and you didn't put Scotty in the movie. Why? Maybe Scotty didn't want to be in the movie. Scotty, bro, you don't think Scotty wanted to be in the damn movie? Scotty wants to check. enjoy his summer. Maybe he just, right, maybe he didn't want to be in it. <laughs> Scotty, Scotty wanted, wanted to enjoy his movie. summer. Scotty wanted to be that in the movie. That nigga said, I didn't want to fuck up my summer. I don't think so Michael would have been I like. I waited to get surgery. I don't surgery. think Michael would have been like, nigga, you can't be in it. Maybe he really you didn't want to do it. Scotty got, uh, uh, Michael got Scotty uh, wife fucked by Future. I'm, because what you the? kept Scotty broke, Mike. Future ended up fucking his wife. Oh, you yeah, got you got to let happen. you got to let happen. that sit on your couch. Oh my god, Mike! That is not right. that is false. Future <laughs> fucked the shit out because of Scotty's wife Scott, because of you, Mike. After Scotty Pippen left the Bulls, he got a big ass contract from the Portland Trailblazers, fifty mil. After his back was fucked up, supporting <laughs> you, Mike. Supporting you, Mike. Scotty had plenty of money when Future was fucking. His Either wife. way, the last <laughs> dance was a great <laughs> documentary. It was. Let's give that woman some credit. Very, We're not just yeah, about the very, money. I enjoyed that it shit. Was, she just wanted to fuck future. It's yeah, not, it's not Scotty's fault. Yeah, Scotty couldn't have did nothing. He's I wonder old. what this nigga's dick is like. Future right. or Scotty? Future. Oh. He gets a lot of bitches, you know what I'm saying? Like that toxic dick hit different, you know what I'm saying? He's like super saying toxic. So that that shit was be funny because someone said something crazy. about toxic sex on, on Twitter and then someone was like, What the fuck is toxic sex? And they explained it and everybody was like, Nigga, that's normal, nigga. Like No, 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 no. That's no every, wait, it's toxic I've had sex. Some tex- like, I've had some toxic sex. Before. What did it entail? Like basically like is toxic sex is more so you know you shouldn't be fucking this person. Mm-hmm. Or just fucking with somebody you know ain't no good. You yeah, know, yeah, you off. know. So it's about the person. It's not about what you do during Yeah, sex. it's not about yeah, what the about sex the is. Exactly. It's more so about the relationship. But the person that was explaining it was just, they were saying all the normal things. Nah. It was nah. like, oh, he choke you and shit. I was like, nah, nigga, nah, that's nah, nah, normal. Nah, nah, nah. That's just, we just horny, that's all. That's it. Yeah. Those that's are just it. things you're into. Yeah. 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 So how do y'all feel about the choking <laughs> shit? Like choking and smacking you. I mean, I, I don't really <laughs> choking get, and I don't want bitch. to be choked and I don't necessarily I, get anything out of choking a woman, but I definitely understand okay. that that's what they want. Uh, so I'm going to use both my hands. Let's take a vote. Okay. I kind of Let's take a choking. poll. Let's take a poll. All right. uh, Who likes choking and slapping? Raise your hand. Slapping? That's a slapping. slapping? You want to be slapped? Oh, I'll slap. you, you got okay. you to slap the like ass. Like with the nigga? open hand or just okay, the dick? You got you got to slap the ass. Hey, I got to choke my I do yeah, you in that thing? I mean, you I can slap that ass. ass but I mean, hey, I know slap a couple her in the face. That's what I turned. I it know, off. I know a couple girls who like that. I don't and honestly, I know one. And something honestly, about getting near death is ex- <laughs> exhilarating. No, because I have a, I have a theory. I have a theory that women, women like to be. I saw God this time. <laughs> women like it's to feel like wow. objects, but only during sex. Right. That's it. Right. No, I very much enjoy being submissive during sex. Not exactly. in real life, but. Right. Niggas always but try to use you, me and in the meantime, use my body. Have you? Right. Yes. <laughs> yes. Right. Exactly. You, yes. Ain't gonna, you ain't gonna talk to me in the old kind of way. You can do. Bed, you can, you can do what you want with my body. If you digging her down, <laughs> fellas. If you digging her you can call down, that's the only place that, That's the only place it should you be. You can call a bitch. Like, you can call a, a you whore. Can go outside of just her. Turn over, bitch. Your mama. Yes, daddy. And she gonna let you say it. If you digging her down right, she gonna let you say it. It's the that's the truth. Because that's like, oh, I love when you say. talk to me dirty. Like, have you ever slapped a girl on the face, though? I have slapped a girl. You face. liked it, didn't you? No. Fine. Yeah. No. I knew she did, though. So I I'm a trooper. Back. My man raised no bitch. Hand, I enjoyed I myself. It wasn't even like a, it wasn't like a. Ah, it was like a. It was like a. It was, like a, <laughs> it was for me. It was like yeah. <laughs> oh, she let you real, real deal slap. Her. You're wild. Oh yeah, oh, you. Are. <laughs> That's kind of. I can't slapped her. Slapped her a little bit, and she was like hard. I said, hmm. Harder, yo! You slap like a girl. I she felt, told you harder. Yeah. If I slap a girl, 
No, 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 no. I can't slap a woman. I get. I gave her. I gave her a firm. Like it was her face. I didn't want to do anything crazy. But this. I can't slap. This bitch wanted. I got heavy hands. She wanted me to abuse her. Nah. I can't do that. And as a as a as a conscious man, can't do that. I couldn't bring myself to do it until she kept asking for it. Hey. Yeah. I can't do that. I can't. I don't want to hey, be. Sick. I had to deliver because I deliver learned that. that women can hey. change their mind on consent at room, any point, I'm, and I'd be I'm, damned if she go out telling people this nigga slapped me while we was fucking. Fuck and I that. told him it was okay, but now that fuck I'm thinking that. about it, I, I am like not it. okay with that. Oh, he slapped uh, me sure. too hard. Hey, look at this. I'm going as far as you want me to go in the bedroom. <laughs> exactly. You want me to DDT your ass? I'm a fucking. I can't even do it. I am too big. I'm too big. Honestly, as a man, hurt somebody. as a man, when sex starts, we just do the normal oh, yeah, shit. Yeah. Can't, yeah, we do the normal shit. The fuck was that? What is this? That that's it. We just fucking. <laughs> what is this? We just fucking. I don't fuck like this. <laughs> we just fucking. My chair was sideways. We just fucking. That's it. I just realized what do dares be doing? And that's when it nigger. started doing so you gotta crazy like, shit. I'm going you gotta crazy. like kind of contain yourself a little bit. I'm going crazy. I'm little. Yeah. I can do what I want. <laughs> I'm saying like this nigga big. <laughs> this nigga be spinning in the pussy. <laughs> The only thing I'm not cool with is that whole chaining up, whipping. Like, I don't get nothing out there. You whipping me. Like, I don't. I really want to try that out. Wait, whipping, whipping me? No. I, I really ain't going to hold you. I, 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 I'll tie a girl down. I ain't. That's different. Yes, That's I like different, that. That's different, but it's like. So do I, I never... want to be tied down? No. No, no thank you. I can't cuff somebody. Uh, I'm ticklish. That's my thing. I'm ticklish, and I don't be trusting these bitches because women like to just they tickle you for no reason. They play too fucking much. Yes. That's they fucking problem. Yes. Why they all try to touch our ass? I was about to ask that. Why don't y'all? Okay, why do y'all get so bothered by it? Why do y'all get so bothered by it? How do you think I am going to respond to that? But why do y'all get so bothered by it? I'm a girl. Listen, listen. How am I girl? Listen, listen, listen. How am I supposed to respond? You just whoop, and I'm just. But then it's like, why can't you be? You grazed past my cheek. Why can't? Why can't you just let it? Why can't you just let it ride? Like, why you gotta get mad? Like, why you gotta be like, April, stop playing. Like, why? You gonna wait? 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 Ahead. Why do y'all do things that make us uncomfortable and still do it when we tell you it's uncomfortable? Huh? If we did it, it was it's it's goddamn. What what it's they call this assault. shit? Assault. <laughs> Not assault. First of all, if he tells me to stop, I'ma stop. But I'm saying, why do y'all get no, so mad? No, you a damn lie. You a damn lie. No, you don't. Am y'all I be lie? like. Why can't I touch it? Yep. Come here. What are you doing? You <laughs> know you like it. It's just the booty cheek. I'll make some rotation. I'm a girl. Or something like, <laughs> No, why you want to grab? Why do y'all want to grab a man's ass? I'm Ain't a girl doing it. My ass is not my ass, but it's like you're my nigga. It's my ass. Like you get to touch my ass, get why can't I touch your ass? I don't want nobody nigga, touching my butt. Equality, nigga. That's not equality. Why? No. You can touch all but my ass. Why can't touch on no. yours? Like, it's not the same, Equality. Do bro. things that make Answer me comfortable. Answer the question, though. It's just not the Equality. Same. You can touch my ass. I don't like it. Equality. You can like grab it. my ass, slap Equ- it. You talking? You like it. You call? You talking equality? What makes you think I like it? Uh, so you don't like because you do. That's not. That is the point. That's the whole argument. Do you like it? I don't. Equality. Do things I like. I will. I will. I just shut the fuck up. I plead the fifth. See, not the fifth. We don't like it, so don't do that shit. Not the fifth. But why don't y'all like it? We already lost. It's because the cliche. That's gay. Like, why do y'all like it? I don't get it. Why is that gay? It's uncomfortable. I'm a girl. It makes me uncomfortable. It is uncomfortable. It makes me uncomfortable. Oh, y'all niggas. There is no straight way a man responds his ass getting smacked. It's just uncomfortable. What? Bro. So if something makes you uncomfortable, I'm like, ah, oh, bitches are just so ah. Uh. That's like you'd be like, this nigga is weird. Right? Yeah, we get labeled weird. We do uncomfortable shit. Like I just walk up to you, blowing in your ear, and she's like, why are you doing that? Like why are you grab my ass? <laughs> it's just weird. Don't do that. Weird ass nigga. It's exactly. like we got to be okay with being uncomfortable. But as soon as y'all uncomfortable, we, we got to stop. Charges and shit. <laughs> <laughs> uh, restraining uh, we, we molesters now because right. we did some shit that made you uncomfortable. But this nigga was a weirdo. Us. He kept touching me. <laughs> Told him I not to. Be touched. This nigga said I liked it. Not even talking about touching, just talking. Like, Sometimes y'all talk to niggas and be like, oh, he made you uncomfortable. Fingers little. It be just too up there, bro. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to. Don't do that, dude. Like, <laughs> so they oh fingers God. little. <laughs> okay, fine. Be, yeah. To every bitch, don't touch any of these niggas' asses. Hey, wow, don't touch his ass. Said, um, don't do it. No one, don't do it. Hmm? Don't do it. You feeling all right? You feeling good, ain't you? You feeling straight, bro. Get some of this shit, man. This some, 
This shit got a white T on, boy. You got to this. <laughs> this shit, iron. they ain't iron the shirt. Niggas said you. I'm gonna take it somewhere. I feel like this is actually pretty decent. I feel okay. Yeah, it's straight. Keep on. You bought this bottle trying to avoid racism. I, I appreciate it. I guess. I is know. it a black owned business? No. Oh, damn. oh my god, it's got a BH on the front. I told you he had. A, it, we said he had an Hermes belt on. Well, I didn't know it said BH. I said Ferragamo. She was trying to peel it. I was trying to desecrate the bottle. Mid- so I said he had a championship belt on. Mid episode, look like Stone Cold Steve Austin. You wanna try some? Y'all niggas gonna get the PS Five? Them niggas Those still geek. Shots, 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 shots. Shot, 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 shot. Y'all, he money with it. Y'all, y'all niggas Everybody gonna get the PS Five? Y'all niggas gonna get the PS Five? Nah. Hell yeah. Well, I mean, that bitch about what did they say about seven? They didn't maybe say the eight. price. They didn't give a price yet. I'm Whatever not, you heard is phony. I'm just waiting on eight eight dollars, eight hundred dollars. It's on, not gonna bro. be eight hundred dollars. Why you yet? think it ain't? Now, now, that, now that I've seen when the it, iPhone drop, that bitch about seven. You but you gotta understand. You gotta understand. They use diamonds to like make iPhones. Like they use very expensive materials. Now that I've seen the materials of the uh, the PlayStation Five, it's not gonna be that expensive of a console. I it st- don't matter. I think it's gonna be about five hundred dollars. I still ain't get my tax return. So guess where that's going. <laughs> so y'all, so y'all like it? I'm predicting it to be about. $500. It's ugly as fuck. It's super ugly. It look like a Wi-Fi router. It, it do. do. Yeah. Yeah, those the memes they was doing, they put that Yu Gi Oh character on it <laughs> with an Xbox controller. Oh, yeah, I saw that shit. It's yeah. tough out here. <laughs> the Xbox ugly too. Yeah, that's the shit Xbox is not that much better. better. It's not that much better. That shit look as like as a motor. The game play five, I don't get but y'all get a PS5 like. for sure. That's sure. Yeah, I mean, well, yeah. Have a P- yeah, I just yeah. I have an Xbox. I want to, I want a PS5. I do want a PS5. It's, it's, I'm, I'm probably going to end up with a PS5 More so because of the games But not because of the console Well I can't right. wait for yeah, Denzel to get it So I can play with it Because I'm not buying it <laughs> I think it's funny how women on Twitter Is like really taking it serious The niggas is like Yeah I'm, I'm, I'm going to get a bitch to buy me a PS5 We're not it, really serious Even though some yeah, some women are really buying women, buying letting. niggas Hey Bosh are you buying PS5? Hey baby if you watch it she Anybody, asked me, you know, trying to. She not, you not gonna buy it. I ain't got no girl. If Come you on, trying you to buy it. a nigga a PS5, you know, you know what I'm saying. But if you want a nigga, buy I'm me a, a PS5. And, you it know, wasn't even that I'm bad. I'm available. We you can know. talk about it. You can it DM me. We can talk about you know what it. Saying? We can make an arrangement on Twitter underscore Freddie Mac. You, you know, know me. This girl rocking over here. It wasn't even that bad. Underscore Freddie Mac. If you trying to buy me a, a PS5. If, so yeah. Sasha not gonna get the PS5. You not? Pull him up she for your nigga. She not gonna get it, bro. Nah, that's for her. Her, man, her me. man not worth it. <laughs> her man not worth it. That's what it is. You had to ask me if I. Oh, this for her. Uh-huh, Girl, just go ahead and get it. Come on, you could. You big, you big daddy Warbucks. You I know do want a PS5 though. I heard it. I heard they about to drop a Grand Theft Auto with all the cities. But what would you? Bitch. No, not you. What would yeah. you do if a bitch bought you that's Grand Theft Auto? What would you do if a bitch bought you PS5 or gave you money for a PS5? Think about like, what they come. I'm gonna be like, thanks. You think that's gonna suffice? I mean, I. <laughs> <laughs> that's why I'm sitting here like, mm-hmm, sure. I mean, I feel like I. She done bought you the PS. That bitch gonna be at the house every day. Whether <laughs> it was a bad thing or not, <laughs> I bought a nigga a gaming system. A nigga got to be at work at seven in the morning. She I gonna be here till PS, six. The PS. I forgot which one I bought. For me to him, but I got let the PS a girl something. do some All shit. Right, like where is he at now? What? Yeah. Where is the the guy you bought the game system at now? What? What is he doing? <laughs> of the f- in the first floor of her house. What? <laughs> I, was just, I was just about to say what what room? First of all, first floor, <laughs> wrong. Second oh, of all, second floor, second floor. Oh, he's, second on, of all, he's on the second floor. Second of all, it's complicated. But that uh, was when we were together, and I got, and I got him that shit. Uh, but I forgot which PS three, four. I don't fucking know the numbers, bro. Yeah, definitely four. Yeah, sure. Did you make him real tail dip? <laughs> I did not. See, Brittany don't be cooking. Man. I ain't never seen. Okay, Brittany first cook. of all, I know Brittany for a long time. These niggas, I do cook. I ain't never Just seen this I never cook, cook for you and Fred. Does again, not mean I don't cook. Again, I've cooked for this nigga a million so again, times what's your, because you offer. What's your, never what's your, seen your top this nigga dish? Brit, Brittany has never brought me a dish. What's, what's your top dish? And I'm what talking about cook? food, plate, glass, fork. I feel glass, like I don't really cook fork. anything. Like if you, st- I don't like. I can cook. I just don't like cooking. What is your go-to meal? If if you, you could, if your nigga coming over and you like, oh, I'm about to fuck it up tonight. You see this face she made when she said, "I'm gonna cook for my." When you said cook for her nigga, you see or you cook for made? a nigga, and you know what I'm saying, she it's don't a cook for niggas nigga. apparently. I'm gonna Uber eat that shit. What? 
Oh, you gonna there it is. Okay. There's the facts. See, see. <laughs> okay. Like I now said, y'all can bake whatever you want. I can't cook. I just don't fucking like cooking. Why? I mean, what's your number one dish? What do you cook? What if you had to cook? What would you cook? What's your jam? What can you cook well? What can you cook well? You know, you you if you cook it, you know the shit gonna be bomb. Be bomb. Like cook, Bust. cook, cook. Not some some shit that's frozen. You just put it on like, the skillet. What, what would you What would you say? I mean, I feel like I can make pretty good fried chicken. Fried mm. chicken. Okay. That's a good skill. Some that fish. Skill. People can't fry like shit. I could. Yeah. There's some people I can who cannot fry. fry. Like I'm saying, I can like you can fry some do shit the up. shit. I don't want to. I remember this girl I don't in college, enjoy bro. It. Like, I remember this girl in I'm college, bro. Lazy. She made some fried chicken. Real high key. I don't like chicken. Chicken was raw. Like, the I outside was so crispy, but the chicken was raw. Damn. That's disgusting. I was like, like I was like, yo, it should but, be misleading but, but too. I knew it was gonna happen because how she like dropped it in. She dropped it in and like she took it out too early. I was like, yo, that's chicken. That should take a while to cook. Right, well, Done. What the fuck is you doing? And I mean, you I can what? bake pretty well. You know I just don't like cooking. If you can't uh, bake mac and cheese, yes. that is a skill. If you can make that, you are an architect. You are an architect. <laughs> that is a that's a skill for and real. And like I said, there's be cooking because there's be offering. He'd be like, hey, I was gonna make. Rotel. I was gonna make motherfucking this and that. This nigga motherfucking made like fried rice and, and ragoons once because he came up with it. Nigga, he offered. See how nice he is? He offered. I'm gonna take it. I'm the complete That's opposite. <laughs> yeah, he made one dish for us. It was good though. I made some for you? Or did I make or did, or did I make it and you came over and had some? I feel like it was brought to me. That's I think y'all might have brought it to me. It's like some nigga pasta some. dish. I thought it was that soup, that green. Oh, that's pea good soup. too. But the first thing I ever had of him was like this pasta dish. It was good. My, my uh, what you call it? Um, it was pasta. Yeah, yeah it was tasty. And why did she get some? Because I put it on Instagram that I was making it, and she. I was feel like, like Mayjohn oh, came and got it. Her, yeah, and she got yeah. mine. Yeah, yeah. She yeah. It home. yeah, greedy fucks just pulled up and ate my my meal prep. And then your green soup stuff is good too. Of course, I'm cooking. green soup shit. What you put in that? Vegetables. It's all veggies, all green veggies. Mm-hmm. Some chicken bouillon, some a little bit of, with some water, obviously. Some chicken bouillon, some other seasonings. Okay, just that just shit just just, real... just boil that down till everything is in the water. I, okay. I mean, perfect, perfect. That perfect. sounds so vegan. Like vegan right there. Oh hotel. yeah, that sounds delicious. Dairy if I was so vegan, I'd eat that all the time. Huh? But yeah, fuck man. being hey, man, vegan. Black people stop eating pork and uh, that bullshit. I don't know nope. about that. Can't eat that. But is you gonna make it though? Long, I don't know about man. that. We got to live long, bro. I, I feel you. Stop eating that bullshit. Even I'm if here I, for, I'm if here for I all buy the time. ingredients, I'm good time. Keep going. Good time, not long time. Huh? If I buy the, I'm trying exactly. to make a make rotel. All these stuff. If I if I buy the ingredients, you said you're trying you to learn how to make rotel. Yeah, his did be good as fuck. Yeah, I'm telling you, once it's, you make a nigga rotel, it's just meat and con queso. It is, but I like it. Not everyone makes it good. Okay. It's just meat and con queso. You would think that, con but queso. literally, they're not think, all good. I know that. <laughs> His shit's good. I enjoy it. Right. Have sure. multiple plates full. Hey, so you're putting shrimp in your rotel. You on the next one? I'm gonna probably buy the shrimp too. Let's kick it up a notch. Go to Walmart for that shit. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> Yo, one up on there. Yo, I had to, speaking of Walmart, I had to buy some masks today for work. Uh-huh. There were some at Walmart. Yeah. Like surgical masks. Yeah. What Walmart? They saw me at Walgreens. Lowski Walski nigga. But no, that fucking that shit them shits was it's twenty five. Seventeen dollars a box. Damn. Makes sense. They capitalizing off this shit. Yeah, my mom <laughs> ordered some from Office Depot. And I had 20. to I had to buy four like four hundred of them. Not four hundred oh. boxes, but you know, four hundred yeah. quantity of masks. So that I do the math, nigga. I don't Jesus know. Christ. But Should I didn't I, I didn't buy all of them. I didn't I I bought like two fifty. Spent like a good hundred. What you change. had? But why you had to buy four hundred on a motherfucker? It was for work. It was for work. Oh, you had to give them out to your people. No, no. no. Well, it was for our personal stock, but we was running low, so we had to get some because well, DC wasn't shipping them in time. And it was a, it was a lot of bullshit. Hands like that. I just you realized. What? Up. So did y'all like the the the, um, the, drink? the shot? You didn't like it? <laughs> why not? Pussy. I didn't like it. It's, it's gone liquor on all type of levels. <laughs> Sasha's so fucking faded. <laughs> 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 that motherfucker eyes drunk. red as hell. Drunk, boy. She ain't moved in half an hour. What she said? That was a good not insult. All not all liquor is bitter. That's a liqueur, nigga. Liqueur. That's <laughs> juice. What did you say? You said you didn't like it either. <laughs> huh? It wasn't. See a real nigga. Whatever. These bitches around here. I'm shocked, Patrice. Come on, Patrice. Come on. 
please. Cause he ain't like it. You don't like Brian. Girl, why are you in my house? <laughs> you don't like Brian. You I was like literally about boys. to say that. No, I was literally about to say Patrice really be drinking that. But who the white fuck shit. brought her? Who brought her? Who's your ride? Why? Why be making you? You, you, you drove yourself? Did you yeah. see Sasha? Did you fall out her chair? Did you drive yourself? Did you drive yourself? No, but did you see her? No, you drive yourself in your own car. Where's your Where's your car keys? Use them. You I like, can't say his you name. Like but white boys. Come get your mans, bro. I hope you watch this episode. Come get your mans. She over here falling off the seat, bro. <laughs> no. I just said come get your mans, bro. Help her. Yeah. Y'all niggas consider yourself like an old soul. Not me. Consider so what? An old soul. I play. Too oh, my much. mom said that I was. I play too much. <laughs> yeah, I'm too childish. I don't know yeah, me, too. me too. My mom said I was. I mean, kind of. But not really. When so you never classified yourself as an old soul. I don't know if I, I feel class- like I did at one point. I don't know if I classify myself as that. I feel like I'd be in the know, but I don't think I don't know. You want to call yourself an old soul? I mean, people. It depends because I know some people say like when a, you're in the know. That I want to talk to soul. someone who who classifies themselves as an old soul because I want people say that. I want to know at what age do you, can you stop doing that? But don't people say that if you're in the know, it's like you're kind of an old soul. Kind of. Yeah, like if you know old music. Oh, yeah, Not you have only a, that, but I mean like. That's how it is for me. I've been playing like some old ass jazz. Like, oh, you have an old soul. It's like. No. I don't think that's having an old soul. I just think that's these just beats are hard, like nigga. Music, like, yeah. <laughs> back up off me. When I say these being, niggas I mean, knew what the like, fuck they was talking about. <laughs> when I'm saying being in the know, like intuition, like whatever. Like people say that's like Does it give you, you were you here before. Soul? Like you were on this earth before. You're an old soul. That's what it really means. I like. just think I'm getting old. My old my age be hitting me randomly. Yeah. Like random like I realized I was old. Mind you, I'm only twenty six, you feel me? Mm-hmm. I realized I was getting old. Like the when, youngest one here today. Well, other than Imani, but she don't count. Anyway, I I realized I was getting old when like I, I started doing that that old oh, yeah, nigga she shit. Is. My bad. Where you, you ever talk to an old head and like he agree with something you say? But he doesn't express it verbally. <laughs> <laughs> well, he just nod at you. Not even nod, but like he'll he'll halfway say something and then point at you and just be like, "That's what I'm talking about." They're like mm-hmm. the sky is blue. Yeah, it is. Oh, I'm so <laughs> done. I do that That's from time, I do that from time to time. I feel like you you know you getting older when the closer you like when you talk to older people. Y'all relate more. Yeah. It's like you know. Remember when you was younger and you talked to somebody old as fuck? It's like you don't even know. You what don't know what the fuck they talking about. But you trying to keep up. But someone the more tweeted, you talk to old niggas, the more the older you get, and they be like, "Yeah." Nigga, I think I, I retweeted that. Shit. Someone was like, "I now understand why old people just like to sit on the like porch or the patio, like just sit outside and like chill." My pops don't like doing that. You gotta slow I down. That like should be that. like a mini vacation. I like vacation. doing that now. You gotta take it all in. Just right. Chill. Just have your little moment outside. Vitamin D. Yeah. No. I, I really like enjoy. Now. I really enjoy doing that shit now. I'm like, damn. <laughs> I, I think am. you getting old when you. Whenever you wake up and do this right here. <laughs> y'all have noticed? Getting old. Y'all have noticed <laughs> motherfuckers with age. like a big belly to just scratch their stomach? Yeah, they do. Yeah. <laughs> Why? And it's always with the middle finger. <laughs> Maybe it is. What the bro? fuck is that? Where'd that come from? Oh, Comfortability. Maybe it's I, that's what I knew I was up. When I woke up like this and did that little ear shit, I. <laughs> <laughs> you old. You're getting old. That's what you're coming I mean, in no, like, yeah, Right, right, quick. The younger For people real. on Twitter really do make me feel like the shit that they don't be knowing and stuff, I'd be like. Right. Like that you said something sad. about static shock. Do you know it's a whole. Who don't know? Yeah. Generation of people who don't know what the fuck you was talking about. Just yeah, like, bro. I was chatting with yeah. somebody that was younger. Oh, and they didn't know what Freak Nick was. Nigga, I was chatting with someone two years younger than me. They didn't know what Simon Says was, like the toy the game or, or, or like what? the toy. That's crazy, bro. It used to be called Simon Says. Then, then it got turned to Simon. Are the kids yeah. nowadays just like we can't relate retarded? to them niggas? Like yeah. I don't know what's wrong. I'm I'm not even. We can't relate. I, to I just them don't know what's no wrong with them. Like they, they just. Like those little songs, like do you know, don't know, <laughs> when they be like on the don't know, and it be the most obvious the shit. The most obvious. I'd be like, it's like when it, then it's like the younger generation. Y'all think y'all motherfuckers innovative? Like, <laughs> not, nigga, we had Vine, then TikTok come out. Y'all think that? Like, bitch, we had Vine. We been doing what the fuck that was <laughs> to on. To be honest, I miss Vine. Over <laughs> no, tic- even I'll take worse. Vine, over tic- Vine was a lot having more see-through original. shoes. They're like, oh my god, these see-through shoes. I'm like, bro, that was like a whole. That that was a failed experiment by us. Yeah. But yeah, let it go. 
Who the fuck? What is the generation after us called? I know we millennials. What what is after us called? X generation yeah. X. Yeah, they're gonna be fucked. <laughs> they, they are fucked. Like there's no social interaction. Like <laughs> Hold on, no. my little nephew, She's that nigga. Ex. Your ex? I was born nineteen ninety nine. Oh, that's X, right? Borderline. So I wait, think it stops at like ninety five. Well, you on the cusp. What stops at ninety five? <laughs> the cusp of X. I don't know. X? Cause she not millennial, so you you on the cusp. Huh? What? No, you have what? You can't be before. We're millennials. We're millennials. Well, no, I'm millennials. Yeah. No, I, I'm millennials. 1999 I think you're generation X. X. Let me. No, not. I think you're, you're not no damn millennial. I think 98 was the cutoff, my G. <laughs> Oof. <laughs> yeah, I think 98 was the cutoff. Sorry. <laughs> so you one of the motherfuckers we talking about. So here. Yeah, that shit ends at 96. But it's like. Oh, shit. Oh. The generation X. 96? Oh, 96. Claims, yeah. Damn. Oh, boy. Yeah, Generation X, they they're gonna be tech technologic like technology. They're gonna be savvy. As I'm scared of getting old and not knowing technology. Yeah, that is. That scary. is like a big fear of mine. <laughs> like okay. I, I spend I, I spend the clarify. week with my parents and they're like they don't know shit and I'm just like oh my god. I have to clarify. Am but I gonna be like this? That's right. that's why it's Hope hard not. because so many people have different. You know how everyone kind of like it's differs scary, the years. Mm-hmm. So by the first thing I just said, that shit ends in '96. Okay, by the one I looked up for her, it's saying she is a millennial. Oh. Mm. So I don't know the truth. It says 2000 is Generation Z. Okay, after 2000. 2000 to now is Z. So what's X? So what's X? 1965 to 1979 is Generation X. Come on now. Oh, excuse me. Also, so we just got the wrong letters. It's yeah. <laughs> okay. Gotcha. Yeah. Wait, I so there's X remember, millennials than Z? Remember when you was like five or six and like... Hmm. Your parents handed you a yo-yo, and that was your entertainment. It's oh, like, I remember the yo-yo. Right. Trying to walk that damn dog. Trying to walk the dog and shit. I remember being <laughs> Eiffel school. Tower. Like, no, these I niggas got tablets now. Just made the cut. What happened? These niggas got tablets now. Yeah. Like, for fun. For fun. Like, for fun. what she do? Just doing shit on that motherfucker. My yeah. nephew know how to build a whole fucking house. You know what's crazy? Kids don't drop them shits either. They don't. Who the fuck don't drop them shits? Fucked them up. But kids don't go outside like They don't drop it as much as adults do, boy. Okay. Hey, man, I'll be around them. I see them. I okay. see them. They got that kung fu grip on that tablet. Nigga, I work they that be watching them motherfucking nigga, videos. I work that variety. All type of bullshit. <laughs> it's I crazy. Done, I done seen the bullshit. This, this world is coming, becoming crazy. Everything's falling. The sky is falling. <laughs> <laughs> Someone's like this year is well, yeah, like 2020 is getting us ready for 2021. I'm like, damn, so what's going to happen then? <laughs> so just going to blow like up. At this like, point, dinosaur is coming back. People I, saying we're going to hit another quarantine by shit. October. Yeah, America is not going back into quarantine. That's what Donald Trump said. Yeah, but in October, he won't yeah, have the saying, authority to do that anymore. They're saying that the shit oh, right. is like going to be super bad. Go out and vote. Go out and vote. Go out and vote, bitch. It's yeah, already it's getting bad. They said they spiked in like 20 states. Like it's like spiking bad. Yeah, because niggas Cause out of Memorial Day fucking up targets and all that. Yeah, we got Fourth of July know. coming up. Yeah, that shit's gonna be fucked. Don't support that shit. <laughs> fourth of July. Right. We only uh, support. You heard about what we, Donald Trump gonna we, do on we, Juneteenth? What he yeah. gonna do? What he gonna do? This I, nigga's I fucking it. having He's a first have rally, a rally in Tulsa where yeah. they had the fucking massacre. Of Hopefully like, that nigga give me my second the fucking Tulsa massacre. That's not happening, my nigga. Somebody's gonna die that day. And clearly, like that whole. It was like a massacre of a whole black like town. Yeah, I remember Tulsa. that. Yeah, that's so where they broke down the black um, Wall, Street. Uh, Wall Street. Yeah, yeah. so they're muff- he's motherfucking having it there, there on, on June Juneteenth. And that's also his birthday. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Even white people were like. Yeah, I don't think. I'm like, are you sure? Nigga, like, why? Wow. That's a crazy world. But you yeah. know what? I respect it. Nope. Because you know what? I'd rather a motherfucker tell me you don't like me to my face. I okay, know I keep, there's no <laughs> hidden area. It's I keep no hearing that area. argument. Nah. But it's like <laughs> you got presidents who who claim they fuck with you. Oh, I'm there for the people and fuck you over. Like people yeah. be loving Bill Clinton. Bill Clinton passed the law with that established more money for prisons than any other president. Yeah. Like nigga, you push. I mean, us no, they're all fucked up. Come yeah, on, but man. when it comes to voting this that's year, that's one of the reasons why I just don't like politics. Like, fuck me over, like I said, bro. when it comes to voting this year, nigga, <laughs> just tell if me y'all don't, don't like vote me. Trump out. Oh, God. oh yeah, Trump. He got it. If go. we have four more years, of that nigga. Oh my. He got it. We won't make another four. We won't. Look what he did. It like someone said. Would you want another four days? Like the like, past four days? Do you want four more years of that? But dead ass. Hell no. Dead ass, bro. We this right. nigga caused a pandemic. 
in a civil rights movement in three and a half years. Hey, man. <laughs> like, what? Wild. That shit crazy. And riots are still fucking happening. Not they riots. Are. Protests are still fucking yeah. happening. They are. Don't believe That's your Twitter feed. Trump ain't Trump ain't in control, bro. He he getting dicked by Russia, bro. Russia he telling is. that nigga to do this shit. Low key. A lot of people believe that. I, I mean think, I think the Cold War coming back, bro. Cause Russia controlling this nigga. They got something on this nigga they to ha- where yeah, they whatever do. they say to do, they have he to. gotta do it. Cause the okay. fact that I don't know if y'all saw that, you know how much money this nigga was trying to I think it's like fucking him, like him personally. Yeah. Oh. I think it owes mad money to them. Yeah, like he, it came out like a month or two ago. He paid them niggas for the I was coronavirus. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> like legit. Like I think he has like buildings and shit over there, or tried to, and like he's like Correct. in debt to China. And Donald Trump has yeah. like a million failed businesses as well. Yeah. Yes. He and nigga has an airline. He but had I'm a saying, water it's just company. Ironic. He had his own stakes. Like this nigga had a lot. He had a fighting promotion club. That shit failed. Everything he did failed. And niggas was like, he's a businessman. He should be president. Yeah, he's like, a businessman for sure. Okay. He's well, a shitty business. I don't know why people shitty. thought that would make a good president. Like, he's a, such a terrible This nigga was on a reality show. For real. Firing niggas. <laughs> you're fired. You're fired, bro. I no, failed like, again. Well, you're fired. You're fired. Because if he dead ass wins again, I'm going to just cry. I cried already when he got elected. I was legit upset. I was like, wow. Where wow. was I? <laughs> like, Where was I? Think I was at, at school doing some project, and we kept refreshing the page with the results for the nigga. for the shit, and like we and it like it fucking happened. he was up <laughs> like no he was like literally up, and we refreshed again. And it was like neck and neck, and then we refreshed again, and then Hillary won the popular vote, and then yeah. some we refreshed again. And it was just like Donald Trump wins. He was like, hmm. Shout out to Patrice. I was at Target. Shit is designed for us tonight. We was like, hmm. Like, like, I don't know if y'all Patrice was. She was 5G phone towers, but the voting machines. Bro. When Trump won, I was in the yeah, break room. Yeah. Yeah. How the fuck the voting machines broke? They've been broke since the civil rights movement, nigga. Y'all ain't got no type of been fixing broke. in them shits. Been I know broke. one voting precinct, they're like, we got the wrong codes. The fuck does what that the mean? Fuck? Y'all got satellite circling the work, earth, though, but can't the wrong, We received the wrong machine. code, so now we have to get the new code. Yeah. I, I used don't to, think this shit look, is set up and read. I used Come to work. On. I used to work. Well, I didn't say I used to work for one. I don't know what election it was. It was probably like a local vote or some shit like that. I worked at the voting polls. That is the most excruciatingly painful, boring piece of shit. Nine, 10, 12 hours I've ever experienced in my life. Bro, this shit is rigged. Y'all did. Look, y'all man. doing the whole podcast off a of cell phone, and this they ain't got working <laughs> machines. <laughs> <laughs> Niggas been going through the same struggle since Martin Luther King was alive. The shits is still broke. No, all that wrong code shit is fucked up because literally all we do is take them shits out the box, set up the poles, space it certain ways, and that's it. Right. Fuck them codes. And like I say, you once you put a card in and you take it down, you give it. That's it. That's right. And then, that's it. Yeah, that's it. They give you your motherfucking sticker. Your shit didn't even count. Here's your sticker. <laughs> <laughs> like, nigga, and you post your shit on your Instagram shit. story. <laughs> right. Which Either is way. And and nigga, you voted for it did not win. <laughs> Either way, they'll still vote, y'all. Don't fucking, please. Yeah, just, oh, yeah, hey, no, definitely. Go out there and it's vote. It's all hands on deck now. Strength, strength in numbers. Oh, that my, did y'all watch, uh, did y'all watch, yeah, Oprah had like a little. Fuck Oprah. <laughs> See that's how I felt. Yeah, that's how I felt. Shit with her but Honestly, she had she had Stacey Abrams on it, so I had to she, watch. No, no, no. If she really she is a part of that whole sex cult thing, like if that mm, actually if they actually Oprah. prove that shit, like that shit would be wild. Be, like that would be, be the tough. biggest. That's gonna be. When she would have put the biggest that, that t- <laughs> the biggest heist. The biggest like this nigga <laughs> Oprah is a is a sex goddamn. I'm not saying that Oprah. She's tough. I was just saying the room because I want to get shut down. You know, Oprah got a lot of power. But like, I would I say, know. I would say, any any bitch with her wig that stiff, a weave that stiff, you got to watch out for the motherfucker. Forever, okay? always that stiff too. All right, nigga, because I watched that shit about Jeffrey Epstein. They're dangerous on yeah, Netflix. Watch I'm gonna watch that soon. I got HBO Max, nigga. That nigga was just motherfucking. Y'all ain't Woo. never met nobody with a stiff wig who was a nice person. Name one person with a stick wig, stiff wig that's a nice person. There's a lot of ghetto bitches with stiff wigs who's actually pretty decent. <laughs> JK. <laughs> you know what? You're stiff as Except you're, Oprah, bitch. Your JK. wig is stiff, Watch but this. you're all right. Oprah be fucking people over. She be giving shit out black of the crowd and taking it back when yeah, they leave. Black people. Shit. So you're not gonna do it back? You get it. Who the car. fuck? Yeah. What are we talking about? I'm drunk. 
Either. Hey, drunk, you feeling good? I'm, I feel good. I'm not I feel drunk, good. but I do feel good. But I feel good. Nice. Yeah, I oh, yeah, feel, I feel good. It's a good little buzz, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I'm feeling yeah. kind of wavy. There's still some more in there if it anybody just, wants to take some. Nick got to work tomorrow, Me bro. too. That's why I ain't taking none. Yeah. Hold on. How much sleep y'all going to What get? time you have to go to work? Shh. I got to be up at like... Yeah, I'm not going to get a lot of sleep. Something. Oh, That's God. Right. Oh, okay. Jesus Christ. You need to go home yes right now expeditiously nigga. immediately <laughs> nigga what time you gotta get up <laughs> immediately huh what time you got i gotta get up to like nine nigga. oh that's good oh, yeah. i am okay yeah, yeah you you gotta look out for it nigga what time this shit? don't don't be like michael jordan bro it's, it's okay. i'm scotty right now let yeah, look man. it's okay <laughs> we're gonna get out of here right this has been Henny haters club episode what what episode is this 23 23 yeah. michael jordan we talked about him. That's crazy. 23, yeah. episode 23. You know yeah, saying? that's kind of crazy. We're getting the fuck up out of here. That's good luck. Mike. Oh, my God. Fuck Michael you, Jordan. Mike. Is it good luck? I'm going to say it is. Scott, you deserve better, Mike. Shout out to all the black woman out there. Oh, God. <laughs> 100. So, I'm going to say goodbye. <laughs> bye, bla- bye to all the beautiful black woman bye. that's watching. We love you and we support you. We do. We love you all the time. Don't ever think anything. I love the black ones. The black women. You and only you, baby. Nobody else. You, baby.